こんにちは、ビバリー、こんにちは。ああ。<笑> I am Josui d i s h i n r i from Hollow Stars English Guild Tempest, こんにちは。I'm excited, chat. I am excited. Wait, chat, why are you guys so far away? Get, get over here. Closer. All right. It's like no real good place to put you, put you all because there's no like. Border or boundary. But yeah. Alright, l chat. As usual, we're just gonna chill for a little bit, give everyone time to trickle in, and then hop into it together so that no one really misses too much. Let me just move my. There we go. <clears throat> Is the live tick going out? Ah,、uh, I knew I forgot something. I knew I forgot something. <laughs> give me just a moment. Live. Ooh. All right, chat. I'm okay. There we go. The tweet is out now. And chat, I am excited. f a m a l i let's go. Yeah. Oh gosh. Okay, so. um What was I going to say? Oh, wait. Today. We're just going to go through the remaining. Oh, wait, hold up. Sab、uh, Sabrina, thank you so much for the gift of memberships. Thank you, thank you. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, wait, hold up.、Um, that's right. Wait, we should go back and, and catch everything real quick.、Um, Meg, welcome to the collective. Sadi, thank you for the super chat. Thank you for using my thumbnail in my day. Thank you for drawing the thumbnail. It looks really good. I love it. The art is very cute.、Uh, Martabak. Alman, thank you so much for the five gifted memberships. Hala and Erica, thank you for the gifted membership.、Uh, Marco, welcome to the Koi l e c t i v e Lace, thank you for the gifted membership. Thank you, thank you. I think I caught all of those now. But thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, everyone. Really appreciate it.、Um, oh,、uh, a couple of things.、Uh, just as a reminder, our evening streams starting now. Will be at 6 p.m. Pacific, 9 p.m. Eastern, and it'll cover,、uh, it'll just be like the usual stuff, but just earlier. Welcome to Spooky Yomi. You're free to be as considerate as you like. <laughs> yeah, anyway, thank you so much for the super chat. Oh,、um, speaking of being considerate,、uh, today we're going to be hopping into the last,、uh, last, I guess, entity? Last spirit? Um, so we'll be going through that. The very first run, I would ask that、um, there'd be no backseating. Just kind of let me stumble around and get into trouble. <laughs> and then after that, after we do the first run, we'll kind of go back and then try out,、uh, try aiming for different endings. All right. So I have scheduled、uh, Pamuli again for next week on Monday. Just one more time,、um, so that we can kind of go through all the, all four different entities and then give them a little shot to see if we can find a different ending. One of the endings that I really want to get is the ending where in the t u y u l we're able to actually find and embrace the t u y u l But I don't know how the, that one is,、uh, I don't know how on that one goes.、Um, it's like, I know the level is timed, but I don't know like, exactly how much time. When t w i l Chance comes back, right? I want to embrace the t w i l I want to. I want to try. But I don't know how to summon the t w i l back.、Um, I know there's like, if you play its favorite music, it may have a chance at attracting the t w i l over it. But you don't want to play with the toys because the t w i l being a, a child, you don't want to play with its toys without,、um, like, without being considerate about it. So, yeah. <clears throat> The two will break into pieces if you embrace them too much. Oh, it's all right. We will give them a soft and gentle hug. So, yes,、um, today we're going to go through a couple of endings for the Hungry Witch Liak. Is that how you pronounce it? I know it looks like Leak, but I know it's not Leak.、Um, so, I'm guessing it's Liak, right? So, we'll do that. And then, Leak, Leak. Oh. oh, there's like a Y ish sound. Leak. Leak. Oh, okay, okay. Nice, nice, nice. All right. So, we're going to do a couple of runs of Leak. 
We'll do like three or four. And then we'll go back and try out the other endings for the other entities as well. Just to kind of experience. Like, I I still want to see the Kuntilana. Like, I, I mean, the laugh was very pretty. It was a very pretty laugh. <laughs> it just might be the voice actress being very, like, having a very nice voice. But it was very pretty. DGGZ, thank you so much for the super chat. Enjoying your Pamela stream so much. Been binging it at home to home on the weekend. Looking forward to the stream. Cannot wait. I hope there's more spooks. More spooky. Quintijan. The <laughs> uh, Leyak only has about 13 endings you can get it easily. Ooh. Quintijan. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> oh, thank you so much for the super chat, Martha Mike. Thank you, thank you. Please do not hold hands with the ghosts, but what if they're cold and they need to be warmed up? Come on, chat. Okay, okay. I missed the Kunti laugh, right? I mean, chat. Like, isn't isn't it a nice thing when 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 they laugh easily, like, and they laugh at your jokes, and like you like you make them smile, and they you know just I don't know, Chad. <laughs> okay, okay. Hang on. Uh, I think we have waited long enough, so. I mean, right? So some of some people in chat get it. Some people chat understand, right? I want to hold hands with the ghost and listen to them. <laughs> Thank you for the super chat, Raylan. All right, let us hop over to. Ooh, and then. Oh, it's very quiet for some reason. How about now? Hand holding with ghosts, much too lewd. Ooh. All right, so we've seen the Kundia Anak, the Pochong, and then the Tuyo. So now we're going to try looking at the Hungry Witch, the Leyak. Sparker, welcome to the Quailite. Like welcome, welcome. All right. So, in this game, we are playing as a paranormal researcher who is, like, investigating all of these. I'm surprised we actually did not get a single ending, like, a proper ending ending for the pochong. Or, like, um, like these notes. Because after you finish each of those, you kind of get, like, little artifacts and little pieces of the story. So, for example, over here, we have the piece of cloth that was bloodied when the uh, storyteller went and uh, cut his hand on a piece of cloth and gave blood to a, um, oh gosh, I'm forgetting the name. It was like a voodoo doll, Jinglat, Jinglat, yeah. So um, after we finish some of the chapters, we get like little pieces of ev ed evidence. But we haven't gotten any for the Liha because we have not checked out. All right, let us go. We're gonna head into this one, which we have not played at all yet. Jenglot is a cursed doll. Ah, thank you for the explanation. Thank you, thank you. And Judik means ghost. Ooh. I must go to work. I'm tired and selfish, but I hope you saw my Koisona design on Twitter. Please take care and have a wonderful dream holding the ghost's hand. I need to get some coffee. Thank you for the super check. We hope you get lots of coffee. Oh, and Chad. If you guys uh, saw earlier, um, a Koi Panion had made a wonderful um, big crew of uh, like a, their art featuring the Koi Panion designs. So if you would, please check those out. <gasps> there, there she is. I see 9999 in chat. <laughs> so thank you for sharing all your Koi Panion designs, everyone. Love to see those. Thank you for sharing them all. All right, chat. Let us check out the Hungry Witch. The Hungry Witch, Act One, the beginning. Oh, this is different. There's no story. It just goes straight into Act One. Ooh. All 
right? All right. In Bali, Indonesia, a pregnant mother drove back home late at night. On the way home, something happened to her mother. Turned out that the danger was following her and the baby inside her stomach. In a state of immediate danger, she had to protect her baby and herself while also unraveling the mystery behind the attack. Little did she know, nowhere was safe until she managed to put an end to everything. That's very ominous, until she managed to put an end to everything. <gasps> oh. March 11th, So this is all the materials that shopping. I <laughs> okay, chat. I'm like in a moment where I'm stuck. I'm like, I want to look, but I also know I have to keep my eyes on the road because I swear, the moment I completely turn around to the side, something is gonna appear. You don't can thank you so much for giving the membership. Like I'm gonna look over this way, and they be like, oh look, this is so cool, and then look over, and then something's gonna be standing in the road, and I'll be like, ah, and then like have to break and then do the whole like stereotypical movie thing, right? <laughs> okay, I think we have to, though. I wonder how long this goes. Maybe this is one of the endings where if we just go home straight, we, we get home safely. Is that one of the endings? Ooh. I kind of want to watch where we go because it looks like there's all... Ooh. Interesting. I, I'm a little bit curious to see where this goes. Like, it's not looping, so I wonder if the developers like really did. Oh, I wonder if the developers really did. Oh, 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 oh uh, I don't know. Uh, right. Oh. <laughs> I think we want to stay on the road. Yeah, quit time jump scare. <laughs> okay. Oh. Radio. You know what? Here, let's turn it on. <gasps> oh. What the? What the heck? Change frequency. <laughs> I just got an achievement called arriving home safely. I... <laughs> okay, so I guess we didn't, we didn't crash. So we get to continue to act too. Akhirnya sampai rumah juga. Sekarang aku harus cari ibu. <sighs> oh, I can't do a baby check. Oh, this is so pretty. Oh my gosh. Whoa. I want something like this. This is amazing. This looks really good. Ooh. Oh, okay. Some buckets are used to hold the water for watering plants. 
this is so cool. Welcome to Bali. <laughs> I hear some noise. Ooh. Food cover. We use this to keep the food safe from my cat. <laughs> Green tea. Ooh. Nice. More scissors again. Ooh, coffee. I like drinking coffee. Me too. <gasps> A biscuit jar. Mom likes to fill these things with other than biscuit. <laughs> I guess this is like a cultural thing for like every culture. It's like a biscuit tin, but it's never actually biscuit. It's always something else. <laughs> oh, it's so cool. Mom and baby. Oh, it's pregnancy milk. A supplement? I like to eat this for breakfast. Cool. I hear interesting like noises there was like a little whirring noise should do the dishes later it's always a sewing kit right ah inspect oh is this um it looks like a small piece of rice on like a banana leaf it's supposed to be an offering we usually put this right after cooking as a symbol of gratitude for the food oh Oh, that's so sweet. Used to love baking, but got busy lately. It's, um, Ren, Ren, Kin, Am, Ginam? Interesting. Ooh. So after you finish cooking, you leave a little bit of, of it here. Ah. Fruits, egg, egg tray. We're running out of eggs. Honestly, same here. I am also running out of eggs. They're very they're getting very expensive nowadays. Grinding spices. It is banana leaves. Ooh. Vegetables? Oh. <laughs> Sorry, chat, I get spooked easily. <laughs> Candle for emergencies. Not now though. Alcohol. Oh. Wait, I... <laughs> I didn't mean to drink the alcohol yet. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh. Hmm. If you want to make offerings, you can have the materials at the garden, at the back of the compound. The back of the compound. Alright, let's go check out the... Oh, ooh. Oh no. A little bit, a little messy, but that's okay. Let's go ahead and close that. And what is over here? Frozen goods. Spicy baby. <laughs> Spicy milk for the baby. Okay, let's go ahead and close the door so that we don't get any cats going inside. All right, let's take a look. We need to find mother. Construction goods. We just finished renovating the house. I haven't got time to clean any of the construction materials. Oh, ooh. Fruit. I don't know what fruit this is. I'm not sure. The girl is rich, dude. I. This is a lot of land, like a lot of space here. Oh, those are mangoes. Oh, I hear that mangoes that are green can be used in dishes and then the mangoes that are like ripe and orange are used as like sweets or like desserts usually filled with hot tea ooh lore ooh an irony ooh <laughs> unripe mango with salt ooh Green mango salad. Yeah, that's the one I've heard about. Vinegar, salt, and hot pepper. I want to try that. I want to try that. I've never had it before. I've eaten like mango, the ripe mango fruits, but I've never had green mango salads before. 
Newspaper and advertisements published every Thursday and Monday. Thursday publication uses pictures. Village economy that keeps rising up. Oh, it's the inflation. Yeah. Right? Village economy. St oh, no, it's just the, the general economy. Readers must be happy with their news. The village economy is steadily rising due to increase in profit in the market margin. Uh, just like just general economy. Unwanted incidents happening. Many confusing and mysterious incidents. Readers are advised to be aware that changes are happening. Oh. I'm like a little bit worried now, Chad. Offering materials. Mom must be the one who made this. Offering isn't finished yet. Mom left it here. Ooh. Apa yang terjadi? Kenapa jadi berantakan gini? Why is that light over there in the distance flickering? Let's see if we can find a way to... Ooh. Alright, let's go ahead and close the door. The flickering light, maybe the wind, right? Just the, just the wind. Small statue. Mom's collection. Aww. <laughs> There's a little... Little butterflies. No, wait, those are moths. Those are moths, <laughs> not butterflies. Why is no one throwing this away? Who listens to cassettes nowadays? Oh, you think this is our family? Yeah, not but not butterflies. Those are definitely moths. Mom and I before we got married. I should replace the battery in this clock soon. Ooh. We used to dance a lot. Thought I heard a door opening on the side, chat. Yeah. Oh, a CD. It's my husband's collection. I don't really like the music. Music compilation of our artists on the webs. Random guy, Vict. Are these really artists? Or are they like, just names? BLI? Blee? What is Blee? <laughs> what does that mean, chat? Blanket. Oh, that's a parody. Oh. I think mom just uses blanket. Still feels warm. Supporter content. Oh, that's so cute. As a way to give a little shout out to the people. It means uncle. <laughs> it's like a mister. Ah, uh, I see, I see. My wedding photo. Oh, it looks so happy here. Oh, what is this one? Oh, I can't inspect this one. Oh, don't turn on the radio at night. Yes, this is mom or dad's. Phone book. Let me open. Addresses. Interesting. They kind of look like usernames. They don't look real. Alpha Wolf? Yeah, that looks like a username. Vidhuan Sak? Vidhuan Sak 1337. Yeah, these look like usernames. This is really cute. Imagine if you help like support the game and the developers put your username in here as a little like shout out. It's very cute. I love it when developers do that. Translate. Yeah, there's a little button. Um, I'm covering it up a little bit, but I'll show you the next time we pick up something. I'll move out of the way. Um, but there's a translate button. Yeah, like let me show you. We'll inspect it, and then I'll move out of the way a little, so you can see here at the bottom. It says if you push the F key, it translates. And I think the really cool thing about the translation is that they keep it with the same like handwriting. So if you see a handwritten note. They use the same person to write it both in English um, and in Indonesian, Balinese. I am uncertain if they are de separate languages. Daddy material. <laughs> okay, how do we get around? I guess we go all the way around the Bahasa. Oh, is that the language? Oh my goodness, there's so many. Look at all that. Is this accurate, Chad? Like, there's just so many bugs. 
Bahasa means language. Ah. Thank you for letting me know. Thank you for letting me know. It is. <laughs> Chad, do you guys you guys hear that, right? Like it sounds like a door creaking open. Oh, this is such a pretty house. It's a lot of money though. She's got a lot of money. Why why are you flickering like this? Oh, it's a light bulb. Um Guess we can't interact with that yet. Hmm? What is with this ominous like woo woo noise over here? <gasps> oh We put offerings everywhere to thank nature. Do you guys hear that? It sound it sounds like wind, yeah, but I don't think it's wind. Oh, the tree fell. It's blocking my way to the garden. I need to find. What? Chad, what is that? On the wall, it looks like. It's. black. It doesn't look red, so I don't think it's blood. I think we're safe. But what is that on the wall? Alright. Let's go and see if we can find maybe like a shovel or an axe. Yeah, let's see if we can find one. I wonder... This looks like more shrines for offerings. Yeah, I don't think we'll see an axe here. The house is so huge though, right? I I want a house like this. <gasps> what was that? <laughs> we had a house renovation months ago. <laughs> I think you can tell. Like my, I was like spooked. I did not expect that. Hang on, there looked like there was a little um, construction section, like some pallets on the other side over here. I wonder if we can get to it. Oh, hmm. No, it doesn't look like it. it. Doesn't look like we can get through. Do you guys see that little hole over here in the wall? It almost looks. Like, there's something in there. Hmm, I'm guessing this must be like a small workshop where we have the tools. Oh, it really does sound like a door is opening. All right. Ah, ooh, a water tank. I always get like weirded out whenever I look up now, chat, because I get spooked. Hmm. Okay, we're gonna look up. Three, two, one. Okay, it's sealed. It's a sealed wall. Okay. okay. <laughs> Find an axe to cut down the tree. Yeah, yeah, we're looking for an axe. Oh. Mm. Find an axe to cut down. This looks very dangerous. It looks like. Oh wait, hold up. Ooh. Can we go? Ah, oh, we can't go up here. Maybe there. I'm wondering if there's like a tool shed. But you're pregnant. Oh, that's right. Son in law prospects go down minus one. <laughs> they usually have a large space in many houses for different purposes one for sleepy, one for cooking, one for prayer, so they don't separate that. Oh. Oh, that makes sense. So we saw the kitchen over here, the toilet over here. I'm guessing that's like where we hang out with the friends. And then, like, that little area over there was for the offerings, and this is like a little patio to make offerings. Ah. Oh. 
luggage. I moved back here. Oh, wait. Chad, we're boxers? I used to do boxing before I got pregnant. Oh, ooh, don't mess with the main character. She's going to knock you out. And yoga. Healthy mother, healthy baby. Mm -hmm -hmm. Ooh, people and culture. Oh, this is so cool. Can we open? Oh. I'm guessing that was that used to be us. I bet our husband took this photo. Oh yeah, because look, it says when we hover over, it says a life before. I'm guessing this is like a life before we got pregnant and married with our husband. Hmm. I don't see any tools that we might be able to use. Being prepared. Pregnancy. Nice. Okay, yeah, chat. That's one thing I noticed. Is there no ceiling here? Ooh, article. Balinese woman. Nice. A letter. Oh, is there a reason why that's normal? Like, um, it's supposed to look like that? Is it for like air circulation, no ceiling? Oh, free air, ah, I see, I see. Letter of assignment. With this letter, it is decided that name, Gusti Mahisa Kanjakusuma, is assigned to two months worth of drilling on our Atlantic oil platform immediately. Two months on the Atlantic oil platform? Ah, huh. I'm guessing that's where our husband went because he had to go work on the oil platform. So, yeah, I'm guessing that's where our husband went. Please report to the oil director. It says immediately, so I had to leave very quickly. Ah, my husband's letter of assignment. I'm used to being away from him. I'm guessing we're also not supposed to turn on the TV for the moment. Ooh, wait, there was like a little thing. Mug. Gift? Aww. Gift from my friends. So sweet of them. Nail clipper. Ah. First coffee. Oh, these are more and more usernames. Chocolate sprinkles. Coffee mix specialty. Greeny juice special. Aww. <laughs> All right. Let's go ahead and check out. Maybe mom's room has a tool that we could. Oh, I guess it's locked. Hmm. I don't see an axe now, Chad. The shovel's near the kitchen? Okay. Let's go check out the kitchen back again. I know we're pregnant, but. And we shouldn't be running like this. But it is okay. The baby will be fine. The baby will grow up to be a very healthy athlete. Like her mother. Alright, let's check out the kitchen again. Running while pregnant. <laughs> mm, axe. Oh, there it is. Okay. Thank you, Chad. Oh. That was a weird sound. That was very weird. That was not a dog, Chad. That was not a dog. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. I first thought it was like a like a like a, a tiger maybe. <gasps> oh. Yeah, I like like a like a boar or a tiger. But then like as it went on, it sounded like ceramic or like porcelain being dragged. That's what it sounded like. Like you guys know what, what porcelain sounds like, right? When like when you drag the porcelain, yeah. The people who made the sound design for this game, very good job. Like I am like spooked. Oh, branch, break the branch. Yeah. 
hey, we may be pregnant, but we're still a boxer. Okay, now I can go through. Can I? Jump over. Oh. Nice. All right. What is that, Chad? Why is it? Ah. Huh? Ooh. It's like all over. I hope it's not blood, because that's a lot of blood. I hope it. Ibu. <gasps> Ibu. Ibu, kenapa, Bu? I think we should be fine. Break the door. Oh wow, she's really strong. Book, book, book. Mom said to find a book. 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 White magic practitioner? White magic. Some are considered as a white magic prediction, uh, practitioner. It is said they have powerful forces that can be passed through generations. They and their descendants are the only ones that can protect people from evil magic, such as evil creatures. And then... Evil creatures. This evil creature is a powerful being. It can take many forms. There's a photograph here. The most powerful one is a flying head with entrails still attached. The evil creature is said to wander around trying to find pregnant women in order to suck her baby's pure soul. The one? Penangal? Penangal? Ooh. She said we had to take the book and... <gasps> a dagger. Mother's book. Apa dia makhluk yang menyakiti ibu dan mengejar-ngejar aku? Protect the baby at all dia, costs. Bayiku. Aku harus menjaga bayiku. Family tree? Hah? Ada namaku di sini. Jadi aku memiliki kekuatan itu. Seperti ibu. 
stab the lid. The sacred and holy weapon. Jadi, aku harus mengambil keris ini untuk mengakhiri segalanya. Eh, apa itu kerisnya? Oh, so we have to use this. Take it. We could have still saved mom. Act three, the journey. She's dead? No. <gasps> oh my god. I wonder if she knows where we're going. Like, oh. Yeah. The main character is pregnant though, yeah. As long as like the knife doesn't appear in the corner of the screen. Entry is forbidden. This land belongs to the I Ionwin? Ionwin family? Ionwin family? Under control and counsel the advocate slash lawyer. Hmm. Private property, I guess. We just can't go. Oh. It's a big mess. It doesn't look like we can go through here. Maybe? We can grab the Ah, oh, no, it's too far. Hmm. <gasps> <gasps> what? Wait, what? Dark, dark goose. Kirana spends too much time trying to find ways of hiding that the very action leads to her doom. The creature caught her and there's no way back for Kian. Kirana. Sometimes being too careful isn't a wise thing to do. Kirana should have been a little braver and quicker on her feet so she can say, I would. Wait, hold up, chat. I didn't realize we were already still being chased. <laughs> it's timed, yeah. Wary mother, you hide too much in the time when you're supposed to be quick witted to save your own skin. Duck, duck, goose, looking for a hiding place too long and being too careful. Hmm. Okay, let's try. Let's go back and try it again. <laughs> More teas. We got our book. By the way, can you imagine we're finally done? Finally got our books. My friends who live overseas have read our books and say they really like all of them. They like the mystical guidebook the most and said that one day they want to have a horror trip to Indonesia, visiting places we mentioned about the book. Ooh. And then. Hope all is well with you. Really loved your game. Would love to translate to French for an affordable price. Aww. I wonder if these are like reading emails the developers got. They love to translate to French. Aww. Okay, okay. Let us go back here. Oh. Act one, two, three, four, five, six. So about like six more, like three more. Okay, we're only halfway done. Let's go back into Act 3. Alright. Let's go back. Only five, I think. Ah, uh, okay. Alright, this time we, we keep running. We're still being chased. Like, see, doesn't this... The cutscene almost suggests that it's safe, right? Yeah, we gotta go to the left. There we go. And now we just run. Keep running. 
I want to say I love these flowers. They're very pretty. Okay, we keep running, keep running, keep running. Ah, uh, I see the fence. Keep running, keep running. I can't even tell. Like, is it chasing behind me? <gasps> Hide. Uh, duck behind the bushes, behind the bushes. Ooh, quick time events chat. Oh no. So, so let's keep running. Let's keep running. I think we're safe. Yeah, I think that might be the. Ooh, wait, 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 wait no, no, no! Don't be distracted. <laughs> we gotta keep running. Gotta keep running. Oh, this is so. I would say like I love how pretty this is, except it's also very terrifying. I keep going. Gotta keep going. Uh, let's stay on this path. distracted. I'm sorry, Chad. Oh. Oh. To the right, to the right, to the right. Oh. Oh, the hands are horrifying. What? <gasps> the right. One more time. Ooh. Attack it. Yes. <laughs> so fast <gasps> is it working I don't know if it's working or not I can't tell survived i think we survived the baby no not the baby we thank you for the super chat i hope maybe we we turned in time and we, we tripped we fell over and we turned to the side so that the baby didn't get hurt These aren't, are these, they look like statues, they don't look real. Oh, well, 
Paper. <gasps> okay. Okay, we can't read that yet. We can't read that yet. Is it does it happen all the time? Oh never mind. It's only once, only once. We are the chosen ones. Our power should be used for the greater good. Greed shall not consume us. <sighs> Coconuts. It can be burned and used in ceremonies. Mm. Ooh. <sighs> Stabbing the flying head is definitely wrong, for it would leave us in greater danger. The flying head is not their real body. The real body stays behind, hidden from the world. Stab their real body, and they shall perish. <sighs> Ooh. The vessel body. So the, the head detaches and takes all the entrails with it. And that's the one that goes hunting. The manangal? Oh. So we have to attack the real body. How do we find it? Yeah, where would the layak be? The, the real body of the layak. Can't open that. <gasps> Kita memiliki sesuatu yang tidak dimiliki kebanyakan orang. Kita dilahirkan dengan satu kekuatan yang bisa membantu orang-orang dari kesulitan mereka. Untuk bisa membantu, kita memang harus belajar agar bisa jadi lebih kuat. Tetapi saat proses belajar itu, banyak sekali godaan. Why are there two though? If we are one of them. Untuk lebih kuat dan mendapatkan semuanya. Untuk menjadi yang terkuat di antara yang lain. Ketika hal itu terjadi, kita akan menjadi sesuatu yang jahat dan gelap. Kita akan mencelakakan orang lain dan juga diri kita sendiri. Seperti makhluk yang mengincar bayi itu ya, Bu? Ya, itu adalah salah satu cara agar bisa menjadi sangat kuat. Tapi kamu jangan sampai memilih jalan itu. Kami baik, dan kami nggak boleh memilih jalan yang salah. Ibu pernah bilang ini sebelumnya. Regulation choose the wrong path. Hmm. It must maybe a twin. They look about the same in height. Like if we if yeah if we line them up it's about the same height maybe twins a sibling a younger or a sister mm, plates or draw kebaya a cloth used by women in rituals okay let us go check out the door because this is where the noise is coming from what? One of the coconuts fell over. Okay, before we go, let's see if there's anything else. What is that? Genetri. Genetri? I use this to count my players. A scarf. People use this in ceremonies to show that they are ready to suppress their worldly desires. Per Penerton? Penerton? To store and give out holy water. Oh. Ooh. Prayer beads, scarf, and holy water. Gebogan. It's full of offerings. Ooh. Alright. There was a noise outside. So. Let's head outside and see what's here. Can't see anything. <sighs> this is a long hallway chat. Oh, I can't even see. Stop. 
lambs? Are they coming this way? Such a pretty voice, though. Wait, who's that? Wait, Dad, you saw that, right? Who was that? Oh, my child. Ah, I see a light. Hmm, it's another room. This must be another memory. Dewiku. Oh, Dewiku. Segalanya untukku. Oh, and this must be another memory. Ah, oh, wait. This must be mom over here overwatching us perform some like offerings or Hmm. Who painted this? What does it mean? A tray of offerings? This room feels like a sacred one. A fire radish. Welcome. Thank you for joining the collective. A prayer maybe, yeah. Okay. With all the power from the goddess, we can overcome anything in this world. But nothing good comes easy. There's no shortcut to everything. With your devotion and sacrifice, you will get what you want. Choose wisely. Okay, that got me, but lore. We, gotta, we need to continue with the lore. To gain instant power from the goddess, chant. <sighs> to gain instant power from the goddess, chant, O oh goddess, the personification of power, strength, morality, protection, let me be a follower, shed me your light. Okay. Oh. The Trishula? Trishula? Weapon of one of the highest gods. But it's fallen over. A mask? I wonder what this is. Benjor. This is an elaborate and specific offering. A suckling pig. Can be considered an offering. Gada. A weapon used to crack skulls. Oh, like a big mace. Yeah, the, the mask looks like a Laox mask. Why is it, what is it doing here? Oh, that's a trident. Oh, I can say his here. Why do you look not happy? Like, why does it look so stern? Painting of an animal. A manuscript. This path, this path leads to immortality to eternity. After you reach the highest level, there's nothing you can't do. You can take your revenge. Kill anyone who have hurt you and your dearest one in the past. Hmm? Barong. Barong is a good entity. Oh... I see, I see. What does this one say? I want to be the most powerful woman on earth. No one can ever stop me. Anyone who gets in my way will die. I'll destroy them all. That... Doesn't that seem a little bit too power hungry? Bow and arrow. Very important in the old wars. The demon is girl bossing a little, girl bossing a little too hard. I thought we were supposed to be holy women who help others. Oh, hmm? only the purest souls who can bring us ultimate power. Born or unborn, they are the purest because they haven't been touched by worldly sufferings. This is my sacrifice. My sacrifice is to devour the. 
My, this is my sacrifice. My sacrifice is to devour the purest so that I can be the most powerful woman on earth. That sounds very much like eating babies. Like the Layak. Is that our sibling? Is our sister the Layak? A shield. Cloth. Oh. Some of you may die, but that is a sacrifice I am willing to live, mate. Is, wait, chat, is it me or is this tilted a little bit? It moved a little bit, didn't it? It was, it was straight up and down, but now it... I swear it moved. Okay, I don't think there's anything else to do here. I don't see or hear anything. This must be the next door, but it looks like it's locked. Who painted this? What does it mean? Huh? I see the bow, the Chris, a leaf, a fan, and a halo, all with the trident. What's all the weapons? Oh. Hmm. Do we have to inspect? Oh, it's a sword. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Um. I'd see a bow, a sword. A fan, a leaf, and a ring. So the bow first. So we have to look at the bow. Right? And then the sword. Lots of weapons here. So sword. And then I'm not sure what that is. The leaf or like a fan, like a hand fan. Anta. Oh, it's like a little bell. Ritual bells can focus her mind during the meditation. Oh, it's a mace. Okay, okay so gotta get this one too. I wonder if there's like a good thing I'm supposed to interact with. Hmm. Offerings. Mm. Chakra. <gasps> Wait, I wonder if this chakra is the last thing. Considered a sacred weapon. Another weapon. Okay, so the bow, the knife, or the sword, the mace. The chakra is here. What is this one? It looks like a leaf. Chakra. Oh. Hmm. Where would that one be? I wonder if that's... Hmm. Offerings. Offering. Symbol of pure life. Paper. Paper. Oh. oh. Great sacrifice and total devotion will bring the strongest women to the most powerful form. Manusia yang paling suci adalah bayi. Terlahir atau tidak terlahir. Dan lebih berkuasa. Melahap yang paling suci. Itu akan membuat kita jadi yang terbaik, yang paling kuat. Jangan terlalu rakus dengan kekuatan, Sutsmi. 
Kewajiban kita itu bantu orang Bukan jadi lebih kuat daripada yang sekarang So this is it. Okay, so this is the the shell. Ah. Similarly as a trumpet to signal a battle. Okay. Sure. Oh, why is there blood? For my goddess, here is an offering of a boar to symbolize my devotion for you. May you grant me all the power in the world so I can be the best of them all. Offering of a boar. Kamu tahu kan, Rati? Kita bisa lebih kuat dari ini. Kita bisa mendapatkan apa saja yang kita mau. Apapun. Suksmi, ingat, rakus dan tamak itu nantinya cuma mencelakakan kita dan orang lain. Asalkan bisa menjadi yang paling kuat. Apa salahnya mencelakakan satu atau dua oh. orang? Suksmi. Bukan berarti kita harus milih cara ini. Kamu lemah, Rati. Aku nggak paham sama isi kepalamu, Suksmi. Orang sepertimu nggak akan paham kekuatan yang sebenarnya, Rati. Seseorang ingin jadi lebih kuat apapun caranya. Kok bisa sih ada orang yang serakus ini? How can someone be this greedy? Oh. Yeah, when you say, like, if we can be so powerful, what's the harm in hurting one or two people? Like, I, I, <laughs> yeah, I think, like, looks me, come on, come on, come on, let's, let's, let's not hurt other people. Like, we, we're, we're powerful as enough as it is. Ah, <gasps> Tony, thank you so much for joining the, uh, Koylite, or upgrading the membership. And then, Binga, welcome to the Koylite Dev. Suksmi is a little bit power hungry. Trying to collect all the infinity artifacts. All right, let's go. Ooh. <gasps> oh, is that? Okay, let's just run, let's just run. What happened to Sukni though? I <gasps> 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 <laughs> Oh my god. What happened to her? Did she like really let all that Greed and power get to her. Oh, huh. Oh no, this does not look like a. Huh? Be the best or be nothing at all. The best or nothing at all? No, six me, no. Only <gasps> Only the Sith deal in absolute six me, no. Oh that one spooked me, oh my god. More notes. What's the use of all these powers if we can't use it for our own? Aren't we the one who suffered to gain it in the first place? She's so greedy. A chant. I grant you all the power in the world. I can give you the strength to end it all. You can be as powerful as your enemy or even stronger. Enough just to kill them. The price for this is simple. Find a gemstone and put it where it belongs. Then chat the mantra. 
oh most powerful, the greatest of them all, grant me the power to finally take my revenge. I'll be your humble servant, your loyal disciple forever. I remind you, no power is free, but if you don't take any risk, you'll never know what you get. You don't couldn't thank you so much for the super chat. I'd like to make the scariest game relaxing to watch. Thank you. First time joining your live stream. Welcome, welcome. Hope I can continue to provide comfy streams. All right. We need to find a gemstone and then recite a ritual. Nothing can come between me and power. Nothing at all. Sooks me. Come on. Oh, I think this paper is important. Once she is gone, I'll finally get to devour the pure souls and reach the highest form, be the most powerful. Once she's gone, I can finally get to devour the pure souls and reach the highest form and be the most powerful being on earth. Signed S. So I'm guessing this is Suksmi. Does she mean us? If she... If she gets rid of us... Or... Or mom? If she gets rid of mom... It, it could be her, it could be our mom, or it could be us, our sister, Rati, yeah. One of those two. To be the strongest, we must sacrifice one that is pierced of them all. It's going back to sacrificing the baby over and over again. I wonder, <laughs> as for Shindi, <laughs> I wonder what happened that would make... Uh, this looks to me so, like, power-hungry. <gasps> Rati's mom. We are Kiana. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Rati's mom. We are Kiana. Oh, that's right. We, we saw the name after we failed and died. Thomas. A knife. Why is the knife bloody? Can it be where we used to pray? More Thomas. Bone leftovers. This is just a memory, so we should be safe, right? Footsteps. Is that blood? Offerings. A little clock. Hmm. Where do the footsteps go? They just kind of go around. Above? I don't see anything up here. Oh, wait. Yeah, we should take the paper. The important one. This one. Take. Okay. Let us keep searching around for... Ooh, a photo. That's... It's a bloody photo. It's titled The Figure, but I'm having a very difficult time mm, telling what's on the picture. The figure of what? This is mom. Why is it bloody? Oh, it I must be mom. I bet you she was talking about mom then. Offerings. We read that paper already. Pelang Kiran? Looks like something can be put here. Pelang Kiran? Okay, let's see if there's any other notes that we missed. Paper. We need pure souls to be stronger. Okay, this is this is just her this is just her rambling now. Like, okay, so excuse me, we get it, we get it. It's colored paper, and it's the same color with the Tamas. Ooh. I've sacrificed everything. I've devoted myself to you. I've passed all temptations. I will be the most... I'm not sure about this third one. I'm not sure about the passing all temptations part. I deserve it. I deserve it? Okay, let's take it. 
the same color as the tamas, right? Put the paper. Oh. Oh. Put the paper. Oh. I see two more tamas, one over here and one over there. So Previous stream inspired me to finally pick up a I hook up with a wonderful time with it. Thank you for the super chat. Alright, I think we need two more, because we have paper with Thomas here. We have two more. So let's keep our eyes out on the wall for something that sucks me wrote scribbled. Over here? No, that's inspect. There is one that sticks out a little bit. Inspect. Mm. It should say take. Take, take, take. Where's take? Ah. Uh, I don't. Oh. She wants to be the most powerful being. I want to be the most powerful, to reach the highest form, to be the best of them all. The best of them all? Okay. Oh, it's the front one. Put paper. <gasps> Alright. One more, one more. We got the one on this wall. We got the one on this wall and the one on that wall. So the last one should be here on this wall, right? Hmm. Who are we summoning? I don't think we're summoning anything. I think we're just going through the steps that Suksumi did when she performed these rituals herself. These are just like, not necessarily memories, I guess, but like a, pe a look into, like a vision into what Suksumi did on her own. Maybe it's... I thought it was like these curtains, but I guess not. Hmm. I don't see it. Where is it? Everything is in black and white, so it's hard to make out the colors. Something like a flashback? Yeah. Can't open the window anymore. What about this window? I, it's like a flashback, but like we shouldn't know this because we weren't here. Um, when we saw... Ah, uh, sucks me. Okay, it's still locked. Inspect. Okay, let's take it very slow. Inspect. Mm. That one? No, we've already read that one. Chat, the fact that everything is a black and white makes it very difficult to see. I don't know where the last one is. Where is it? <laughs> Sucks me, please. At least use color when you write these crazy notes for yourself. Are you holding on to it by any chance? No. Is it on the clock? On the ground? Inspect? No. This might take a while, chat. I have no idea what it looks like or where we're supposed to go. Hmm. Paper inspect. No. Footsteps. I'm like fairly certain we've checked everything now, but I don't know where it is. <laughs> hmm. It's hard. It blends in the papers of the wall. Yeah, it really does. Ah, uh, inspect. No, we gotta find the one that says take. Sucks me, please. Please. Where is the last one? 
Oh, oh, it was on the ground covered in blood. Mom's name. I need to get rid of her. The protector of the pure souls. I have to kill Rati. Oh. She was talking about mom. Take. Put the paper. Aku sampai begini cuma gara-gara dia ingin jadi yang paling kuat. Sorry, Chad. Give me, give me just a moment. I need to stretch real quick. But like, <sighs> oh, sorry, Chad. I was like stuck in a what, like a in a weird position for a while. Okay, I love, I love and like how Kirana is just like not like mad. But like slightly annoyed. She was like, I have to go through all this just because you want to be the most powerful. Like, Kirana has had enough. You know, like she's over it already. Yeah, like, are you kidding me? Like, come on. Alright. Let's see what spooks there is. Kirana's pregnant. She's tired, right? She's like, I don't have time to deal with this bullshit, sis. Come on. <laughs> oh. <gasps> oh, wow. Such a huge gate. Why is it here? Ritual is when people burn these kind of coffins. Sangha chukku chuchuk. It's burnt. Ooh. It's a graveyard. Another one. Ngaben ritual. More of them. All the flowers. Oh, okay. They do stick out a little bit. Yeah. So we'll go check out each of these. Oh, there's so many. Chad, what is going on? I wonder if... What do these coffins represent? When people burn these kind of coffins. So they aren't like a corpse burning? The people that Suksmi killed? Oh, maybe. Her victims. Eight so far. Nine. And then this would be ten. Oh. oh. Those who long for immortality means they are still mortal on earth. The greed makes them forget that they are still an earthly creature. Make it that they cannot be together with their earthly body. Kill their earthly body, their real body. Stab the end of their neck so they cannot go back. Stab their weakest body. Because thankfully, they are just like other humans. When their real body is wounded, they cannot go back. And they will die with their earthly real body. 
It's a mannequin. It looks like the coffin for the for Ngabin rituals. What is this for? Well, oh. Papaya Jantan tree. So this is not the real body. This is just the <laughs> job. <-chan. laughs> I was spooked. Okay, I just didn't see the link. <laughs> I was just expecting something to cover up half the screen so suddenly. <laughs> it's a mannequin. And all these coffins are here. Huh. And it looks like the way to the back is all blocked out with these trees, so... It's always a mannequin, isn't it? But this is a mannequin, so we can't really do anything with it at the moment. I guess we have to go back? And then trick her into showing up again. It's when they burn these kind of coffins. Mm. Try stabbing the statue. It didn't give me an option to do so. It was just to look at it. Ooh. Alright, hang on. I'm gonna head over all the way back to the beginning and then we can try this one more time. Okay, so from here. I wonder if we're supposed to interact with each of these? Like that. And then we just follow the flowers. Flower over here. Flower, 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 flower. No, it only gives me the thing. Oh, wait, Chad, you're right. Let me go grab one of the torches and let's see if we can light the coffins with one of the torches there. Right? Flower. Flower. Ooh. Oh, we can. We can't take this one. Okay, here we go. Please let us touch fins. Oh. Burn. Oh, it's a big flower. Oh, sorry, big fire. Okay. Flower. Flower. Fire. Oh. Flower. 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 Fire. Flower, flower, fire. Hanya senjata yang tajam yang bisa melukai tubuh aslinya. Ketika dilukai, kepala terbang itu tidak bisa kembali. Kekuatan yang begitu spesial dan begitu sakral, yang hanya bisa didapatkan dari para leluhurnya. Couldn't have been anyone else. It had to be us. As their sister. Oh no. Flower. Flower. Fire. I can't believe it had to be us. As her sister. That's. Ah. Oh. Fire. Senjata ini harus disucikan. Mantra harus diucapkan untuk bisa membangkitkan kekuatannya yang suci Agar ia bisa membantumu dengan kekuatannya yang paling tinggi Saat senjata ini sudah suci Ia bisa digunakan untuk menyahkan kejahatan Hmm... We had to, that's right, we still have to do a chant 
Fire. Do we have to memorize the chant? I... No, 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 no. The chants that we got, the, the chanting that we saw, were chants from... from uh, Suksmi, which were the chants to try to gain power. We don't, have, we don't know the chant right now for... Um, how to bless the Chris. We don't have that one yet. Alright. And it once and for all. bisa menghentikan semuanya. Aku harus menemukan tubuhnya dan menusuknya. Oh, this is just a rehearsal. We have to find the real body. <gasps> Unraveling the truth. Achievement unlocked. Yeah, this is just a rehearsal. It's practice. We have to go and find the real body now. Act 5, the redemption. Yeah, now we need to go find the real body. <gasps> oh my god. Okay, so it was like a vision that we got when we passed out for a little bit. Oh. Parry with the Chris. I need to find the real body fast. The real body isn't hidden in a place where life and death meet. Life and death cemetery. Whoa. Yeah, it stopped laughing. I think we managed to hurt it and knock it back. Kinana remembers the chant. She's able to recite the chant on her own. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Crouch over. Okay, the place where life and death meet would be the cemetery, so let's head over to there. And then look for a tree that her body might be hiding under. Slash. Yes. Why is it so fast? Oh, okay, okay. I think we're on the right path. I think we're on the right path. Sakelar tete, setiap kegelapan pasti ada terang. Terus setiap ada kesetaraan pasti ada pekenal hati ini. Ini ada petang, sih ada lakar terus terusan tete. Sebabnya ada sinar pasti lakar nepukin aja. Oh, attack with the axe. No, dodge, 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 dodge. Oh, okay, that works too. We can, we can just stab. I didn't realize we still had the axe. Oh. Where is the cemetery? Oh my god, how much longer do I have to run? This way? I 
I think the correct option is to defend each time. <laughs> Slash. Agar tiang biar ngebantu mengalahkan kejahatan di gumine ini turun kembali yang sinar cahaya yang hilang. Ooh, hey, it's one of those dolls again. I would say Kirana is like super healthy. Being able to sprint and fight and chant at the same time without feeling out of breath. The evil doll. Yeah, we're gonna ignore the doll. Oh. I think we're here. I think we're here. Oh, ini setranya. Oh my god. Agar bisa menyelamatkan kebaikan Gumina ini. Dari kejahatan anak kejijak kembali yang kedamaian yang sarang sami idamkan. Aku bisa menghentikan semua ini sekarang. Oh. Act six, the last battle. Maju sini, aku udah nggak takut lagi sama kamu. Oh, so that's what the fireball is. It turns into the fireball? I need to find her real body. It's gotta be... Wait, we don't have to light these on fire. Okay, they're already burned. They're all burned. <gasps> Attack with the Chris. Oh, okay. Tree, 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 tree. Not that way. Oh. Okay, we have to find another way. We have to find another way to the tree. Right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Ooh, what are these? Wait, don't get distracted. Do we have... <gasps> Attack with the Chris again. Oh. Okay, wait, we need to go find... Chat, there could be lore. There could be lore that we're missing. Okay, all of these are already burned, right? We don't... <gasps> Attack with the Chris. Uh oh. <gasps> Wait. Aku harus pergi ke sana. We attacked with the axe, but that was enough to put out the fires. Look. I think that might work. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Run. <gasps> oh no. Not the baby check. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go. Her real body will be left. Oh. <gasps> oh. Oh. Where's the Chris? Where's the Chris? She knocked it out this way. It flew this way. Where'd it go? Uh oh. Uh oh. I don't see it on the ground anywhere, chat. Did it fly all the way over here? I don't see it, chat. Oh no. Is it hiding? I saw it fly this way. But I don't know where did it go up here? No, we can't climb that. Uh-oh, uh-oh. It doesn't even tell me where it flew. <gasps> Attack with the axe. Okay, we still can use the axe. We can still use the axe. Okay, I guess it knocked it away someplace really far. Offering bowl, no. I wonder if it threw it all the way over to the other side. Where's my Chris? I gotta look for it. 
Kiana, I am with you. But girl, I have no idea where it went. Unless it like threw it all the way over here. Ooh. Can we just escape? <gasps> Axe. Check the coffins. Oh, the coffins. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can check out the coffins. We can check out the coffins. It, they wouldn't just like throw it onto. Oh no. Uh oh. Engage. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I don't see it. I don't see it. It's not here. It's not here. It's not here either. It's not here. Oh no. Did it fall inside here? I don't see it either. Where is it, Chad? Oh jeez. Did it fall inside this one? No, I don't see it. Over here? <gasps> uh oh. so close to defeat the entity but she was not prepared enough to develop her own strategy which makes her attacked by the entity first if only Kiana could move smarter maybe her fate wouldn't be like this maybe she can return to her normal life and hear the cry of her baby mm. a vanquished mother defeated her when it was so close to reach the happy ending it's by the fence We got an email from no name. I'm witch. <laughs> You've been looking for my story. You want to know my story that much? Don't cross the line. I warn you that I'll hunt you for the rest of your life if you dig too much. The witch uses email? The Layak has an email address. Oh, that's kind of cute. I, Chad, can you imagine the Layak there floating in front of her like laptop, typing away like, I know you've been looking for me, don't you? Like, oh, it's kind of cute. She's modern, right? Or maybe she has a smartphone and she's like, you know, typing on the phone. <laughs> High tech Layak, right? <laughs> moe, moe. <laughs> okay, let's do the last battle one more time. Is she a VTuber? <laughs> She's a VTuber. She can adapt with technology. Okay, chat, let's be honest. If these entities could adapt with technology, then that'd be very scary. Alright. So the first thing we gotta do is... Okay. I need to find her real body. So her real body's up here. We run this way, and then attack with the axe. Oh. Well, that didn't work. Maybe duck sometimes. Okay, we can try that. Alright, so here's the fire first. And then we just wait. For her to show up. Right? Yeah, we just wait. We could just chill. Andrew Hamilton, welcome. Thank you for joining the collective. Let's go a little closer, like right here. And then she's taking her sweet time, but like, I, I guess we try ducking. Fight with the curse, or you'll take damage. Ooh, okay, okay. How's the weather? It's nice and toasty by the fire. That's all I really have to say. Okay, so we attack once with the Kiris, and then we duck next time? Does she not spawn near the fire? Maybe she's afraid of the fire. Maybe we have to stand over here. Uh, 
Um, she's checking her art tag. <laughs> Leak Chan, come on, this way. Over, over here. Oh, there you are. Over here. Maybe she's shy. Maybe, yeah, we, maybe we need to go close to her. Around there? So, like, she's patrolling this area. So, if you stand here, she'll loop back in a, a pop. There. Oh, there. Chris, there we go. Okay. And she's over there now. So? Uh, wait, no, come back. <laughs> and now we get the axe, right? Because the axe is the one that pushes her back. No? Wait, the last time we used... Oh, wait, there we go, there we go. <gasps> nice, nice. Now we can go back. Oh. That one is scripted, so we don't actually take damage from that one. And then, it says, by this one, by the fence, by the fence, by the fence, 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 fence. Uh, I don't see it, chat. In the bushes on the other side? You passed it? Use the axe on the tree. Oh! I can't use the axe on the tree, no. In the bushes. I don't see it, chat. I don't see it. Where is it? Near the fire? No, it's not by the fire. I thought it would be around here, but I don't see it either. Underneath there. Check the other side. Okay, we can check the other side over here. In the coffin. I don't see it inside the coffin. No. Um, I really don't see a chat. In the coffin without the roof. So like here's a bunch of coffins. No. Oh no, Chad. <gasps> uh oh. <laughs> sweep the fence. Okay, we can go back and sweep the fence. It's not there. All right. Here's the fence, and we'll sweep it slowly. I think this tree just blocks you into the arena where you're fighting and you can't um under one of the coffins <gasps> duck 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 ah <laughs> uh. <laughs> chat i have no idea because everyone's telling me different things <laughs> Everyone's saying different things. They're all over the place. Check under the coffin. Inside the coffin. Go over there. Check by the fire. It's not there, though. Ebook. Ooh. All right. Like, it doesn't even glow. You're going to get one guide. I'm getting one guide, but, like, there's a hundred one guys, and they're all saying the different things. <laughs> Maju sini. Aku udah takut lagi sama kamu. <laughs> All right. Okay, so I know in order to not take any damage, we have to use the Chris to defend while we have it. So we defend ourselves with the Chris twice. Okay, here we go. Use Devil Trigger. <laughs> okay. And then... Uh, Leia Chan. Where are you? There you are. Okay, first Chris. Oh. Wait, that one didn't register. Okay, that, that's fine, that's fine. We'll take the damage. Okay. 
We'll sit here, and then she'll go back here and then spawn above us. Chris, Chris first. Harry, damage her. And then we need to do this one more time. Ah, oh, there she is. And there she goes. There she is. Okay. One more time. Parry, parry, parry. Oh. And then we need to defend one more time. And then on the third defense, the fires go down. One more time, one more time, one more time. Parry, parry, parry. Alright, and now she's gonna be a drama queen and be all. Uh, now the fires go out, and then we can go up there, but then she's going to knock the Chris away. Okay, so this one, right? This is the one that you guys are saying, right? Under the third row coffin. So it's either this one or that one? Under the third coffin, under casket number two, to the left. Chat, I have... On the left. Okay. Beside the third, the one with the on the right, the third. Oh my god, you know what? Here, we'll go check them all. We'll go check them all. I don't see it. I don't see it. Over here? There it is! There it is! How did it fly all the way over there? Finally out. <gasps> uh oh, not the baby. Ooh. Ah, excuse me. All right, let's go. Where's the real body? Where's the real body? She wouldn't be dumb and like sit in the middle of everything, right? Udah aman sekarang Gak ada lagi makhluk jahat Meskipun Aku gak bisa nyelamatin ibu Seenggaknya Semuanya Udah selesai sekarang Successfully defeat the hungry witch a hard journey full of struggles that Kirana went down, went through ends with a victory. Kirana manages to defeat the creature and bring the village back to a safe and peaceful place. With the strength she possessed, as well as the courage in her heroic act, she receives respect from all the villagers. Kirana is a hero for all of them, including her own baby. She can protect the baby until the end. Ah, let's go. Oh. Wait, there's another act? Oh, act 
7, a new chapter. I swear, if Kirana has twins and the same thing repeats again, I'm going to flip a table. That can't be right. I wonder if he plays the, the, the little, the baby. Oh. Oh. Oh no. This is mom's room. Hari ini malam bulan mati. Pantasan gelap banget. New moon. Don't want it so dark. Oh. Gak kerasa. Udah tujuh bulan semenjak kejadian itu. Hmm. Semoga bayiku selalu aman. We're packing up all of mom's stuff. <laughs> Lucu banget sih bayiku. Yeah, why is the... I don't like the backup music. Wait. No, not like that. Oh my god. The perfect mother. You're so determined to protect your baby, although it means you have to fight against the evil. You did everything right, but... Chat. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, chat, this is why when your dying mother and a white magic practitioner tells you, Kirana, take the book and read it. It tells you everything on how to keep your baby safe, right? This is why you read the whole book. You go from the very beginning to the very end. You have to read the complete thing because just then we noticed that there was a page we did not read. Kirana did not read the entire thing. You have to read the whole book. Exactly, chat. The lore. You have to read the whole lore. You have to get the entire picture. Because the very last page of the book said, Don't leave your baby alone during the new moon. Ah. Oh. After all that, too. Zimai, thank you so much for the super checking on of the lore. Yeah. Okay, wait, I want to do a couple of things. There's a few things that I want to change and I want to explore now. Um, after the phone call we had with mom, how could she leave her baby alone, right? You got that SCA blood in you. <laughs> Horror characters never leave, they don't, they really don't. All right, now let's try to see if we can find some alternate endings. Go left now, yeah, we can go left. All right, we're going to skip the dialogue here. Let's see if we can skip it. Oh, we can't skip it yet. Yeah, we're going to take the, the wrong path. Skip ad. <laughs> the water. I can like spin around. <laughs> yeah, we can't skip this one. Yeah, yeah. Hati-hati ya di jalan. 
kepikirannya langsung samperin ibu ya pas udah sampai rumah. Stan. Khawatir. Tapi aku belum beli tiket. Upgrade the membership. Ini udah semua. Oh, real quick. This is why women in Indonesia have to be careful with blood because they believe it will attract the Kuntilanak or the Leak. Oh. Mother and baby magazines. A gift. A gift for mom would be happy to receive this. Pregnancy milk. A card. And God never forgot this. I can't go through the highway without this. I wish my baby would grow up into a healthy one. I always bring water bottle to save the world. Aww. Fruits. Healthy for the baby. Incense for the offerings. Nice. Another baby gift from a friend. I'm so excited. Ooh. Okay. Oh, car lamp. Yeah. The radio. Oh, let's turn on the radio. Turn on. Frequency. I don't. I can't hear anything. Should I listen to some music? Yeah, what happens if I'm not paying attention to the road and then I just kind of... Oh, turn, turn to left, 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 left. Okay. I guess it doesn't change it, it just still goes. Oh yeah. Oh. Shortcut to the village. Nothing, nothing happens. Nothing changes. <laughs> yeah, we turn to the right, and this time we turn to the left. I don't think anything happens, though. Akhirnya sampai rumah juga. Sekarang aku harus cari ibu. Hmm. Maybe try not picking away. Okay, we can do that. Oh, and if you guys are, hang on, let's continue. Uh, let me show you real quick. Uh, for those of you wondering where our husband is, just let me show you real quick. Because we have a little piece of lore that explains what happened to our husband. Only a little bit of different dialogue, yeah. So our husband is currently offshore. With this letter, it's decided that our husband here, Gusti, is assigned to two months worth of drilling on our Atlantic oil platform immediately. Please report to the director for further instruction. Chief drilling instructor. So this is where um, our, our husband is, currently outside. Um, working really hard so he can make some money for us. All right, wait. Let's try going back. Close the document. Let's go back and let's not make a decision. Ooh. Eerie. All right, so... What happens if we don't make a decision left or right? If we just... Just let it drive? <laughs> I want to find out. Runs into the tree. I hope so. I want to see what the difference is. <sighs> okay, I'm not even going to touch anything. I'm just going to let the entire scene play through. And then we'll we'll see what happens. <laughs> Tisker. <laughs> Very crunchy today, yeah. And it's only a Monday chat. We're gonna have the car crash. I wanna know if this is an ending, you know? You become crunchy when you approach 30, yeah, you do. <laughs> Somebody crack a glow stick, Chan Chan, thank you for the saber chat. Yeah, 
you have the option not to drive at all. I don't think so. This part's completely scripted. Like, we're on the rail. And if I look down at the controls, it doesn't... Oh, wait, hold on. Headlamp. Oh, turn off the headlamp. Okay. Turn off the headlamp. Turn on the wipers. Can I hit, like, the brakes? No, I can't. Cannot hit the... Anything else. Okay, now we're going to be dangerous. We're driving at night without a headlamp. Self-driving Tesla. <laughs> no, no horn. And then let's see if we get a different ending by just driving at night without the headlights on. Crash 80% speed. Run. Yeah. I wonder if the game will just automatically choose one of them. I have a feeling it would. Yeah, Kiana's driving really fast for a pregnant lady. <laughs> Especially at night with no headlights on. Like, this is pretty fast. Alright. Here we go. And if we don't make an option, we don't decide. We just let it go. What happens? Oh, come on. The game just picks. Man. We just go we just go away normally. The road is creepy at night. Man. Oh. Turn off. Man, I thought there'd be multiple endings. <gasps> <laughs> The dog still got me. <laughs> oh my god. Hmm. If you take the shortcut, will you get home faster? It's the same? I don't think so, because Act 2 starts the exact same way, so I don't think it really matters. Akhirnya, sampai rumah juga. No point in and choice either, right? I'm a little bit like, meh. Okay. Let us go ahead. And since we know most of the things, um, we can't really interact with anything here besides just the axe. <gasps> wait, wait, wait. We can be very disrespectful, right? Like, let's see. Can I... So I just want to say, hello, Gracie. Thank you for stopping by. Okay. <laughs> let's head over to the kitchen, grab the axe, and then let's just be disrespectful. And then we'll see what happens, if that changes anything. You know? Take a bath at night. Yeah. I wish I could. Okay. Go in here. We're going to take the axe. Look. Oh, I can't take it until later. Okay, alcohol. Drink. Nice. Oh, we can't drink anymore. Um. Open that. Open that. Haha. -ha. We're being rebellious this time. I'm gonna leave all this open so that the cat can get in. Haha. -ha. Um, oh yeah, radio. Let's turn the radio on. I don't hear anything. I wonder if this changes anything, you know? The maximum disrespect run, yeah. Oh, this is so scary. I want to go up here. I wonder what's up here. But I can't climb up this thing. Hmm. I don't think there was anything else that we can do. Constantly look up at the trees. 
Now we can go pick up the axe. Maybe the Layak is different from the rest. Yeah, maybe the story of the Layak is a bit more um, streamlined, you know? <gasps> oh my gosh. Oh my god. <laughs> Considering Layak isn't a spirit but a witch. Ah. Okay, take the axe. Huh? No, that's always been there. Hmm. Yeah, a rat jump scare. Okay. Alright, so let's go back. Because once we break it, it's a cutscene all the way through. So maybe we should check out this area first before we continue on. <gasps> Sangha. I think we have a place like this for every family in Bali. Ooh. Can we be more disrespectful though? This is really cool. I feel the moths in my mouth. <laughs> just running around with your mouth open, just ah. <laughs> All right, let us try finding some other endings. Yeah, we can go and try the other ones. Hmm. It's just a cutscene though, isn't it? So we break the branch and then we climb over the branch. Jump over. And then from this point on, it's mostly just a cutscene. I don't remember it giving the option to do anything. Like, we get here and then cutscene. Can we go out when the Banaspati appears after the cutscene? Maybe. I think it disappears by the time we turn around though. All you need to know is in the book, but you have to read the whole book. Okay, yeah, and this part is all cutscene until we get over to um, the corner, and then we see the Banaspati, and then we hide. After we hide, then it gives us control again. So, like right now, still cutscene. Huh? Bola api. Apa itu? Nggak, nggak. Aku nggak mau ambil resiko. Aku harus sembunyi dulu. Ah, perutku. Bola api udah hilang belum ya? Goes over there, and then. Can you go back to the... Can you go back to mom? Okay, let's see if we can go back to mom. No, it does not give us the option to go back. It's blocked off entirely. So the way to progress is to get mom's book. But... Is there a way to get the Banaspati to attack us here? I last saw it on the other side over there by the kitchen. So if we go hang out by the kitchen, maybe it'll come back and attack us. If you stay there for a while, yeah. I saw it like floating around here like this. So maybe if we stay here a little bit. Oh, the chimes are going off really intensely. water when watering plants. Yeah, what happens if we grab the fireball and throw it into a bucket of water? 
What happens if you don't take the book and the Chris and just run? Okay, let's see if we can do that. Oh. No, chat, do you see this right here? This is the little pathway that goes in the back. And then over here, right there, is that crack in the wall that we've run out of. But we can't get to it from this side. And... We can't get to it from this side either. Yeah, right there. See, there's the crack in the wall. Mom's room is over here, the window that we jump out of. But we can't access this because it's blocked from both ends, so we can't run away. Out of house renovation. Maybe we can go up from the front door? Just run away? Because in the other stories, it gave us the option to just get the heck out of here. Let's see. Do we have the option? We do. We do have the option. Let's go. <laughs> I'm running away from my own good. I'm sorry for leaving you behind, Mom. Oh, no. Mother did order Kirana to take the book from her room so that everything could be revealed, but Kirana chooses to run away from the situation. The threat of the creature is too frightening for her to stay and fight. Even the danger is still lurking outside the house. Her fate before the sun rises is really at stake. She is unlikely to survive. Ah, Irresponsible mother. Run away, leaving your dying mother and endanger your baby. <laughs> Running away. Hmm. <gasps> A new comment. I like all the episodes so far. Keep up the good work. Aww. Okay, what other things have we not tried yet? We've tried the, we've tried running away. So like in the other uh, areas? Document results. Ooh, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, 12, 13, and then potentially more over here. In the end, don't choose stab the neck. Yeah, okay. What happens if we... Oh, oh shoot. Wrong one, wrong one. Oh, no. Yeah, what if we ch choose to stab the other parts of the body? Close document. Let's go back. Oh, that still spooks me a little bit. Okay, the last battle. We remember where the Chris is, so... The, the kid is sweet, so we can, like, find it again. <laughs> You can miss the quick time event in chapter three. Oh. In layout lore, if you meet one, you can just run away from the island because it won't chase you. That's one way to deal with it. Oh, just run from the island entirely? Oh my gosh. Hopefully, Chris not gotcha. I hope so too. Okay, go here. Fire. Get out of Bali, basically. Okay, so I see the Layak go this way. If we stand here, we should trigger the Layak. Chris first. So we can knock it back. <laughs> the the Layak doesn't have a visa. <laughs> it's like. What is what is your purpose in coming over here? <laughs> is it pleasure or business? And it's like, oh, it's just business. I like, can I have your visa. And then Lily X like scrounging her mouth, like no pockets. So she she can't carry around the visa because she doesn't have any pockets, right? <laughs> oh no! Ghost is region lot. Chris, okay. All right, and now the drama queen scene. Oh. Oh, we have to do one more time, one more time. The real disrespect is from the chat, right? <laughs> yes, again. One more time, one more time. I noticed that she's covered with, like, flies. Do you see that, chat? 
when you get very close, um, when she gets very close to you, like around her tongue and the organs, you can see like a whole bunch of flies around it. <laughs> she needs Nord VPN to get him. <laughs> okay, third coffin. Is it here? Okay, it's still here, it's still here. Yes, yes. <laughs> Have you ever wanted to continue chasing a pregnant mother so that you can eat her baby, but she escaped Bali and now you can't have a visa? Well, this dream is... <laughs> well, with, with NordVPN, now you can... <laughs> it's a very specific advertisement for the Layak. <laughs> oh, not the ad, right? Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, I think it'd be hilarious if there was like a like an entire like agency designed for like advertisements for like entities. Oh, there it is, there it is. Oh. Okay, we stabbed the wrong part. Let us stab the heart and see what happens. Stab the heart. <gasps> a grave mistake. Kirana stabs the wrong part. Sometimes only a simple matter can differentiate right or wrong, or success and failure. And Kirana, after all she's been through, chooses the latter over the former. Even though it is still the creature, it still gives the creature a hard time, the mistake cannot end the evil deed. Now, Kirana must suffer the consequences of her grave mistake. Oh, it just ends. Yeah, I assume if we stab the shoulder, it's the same thing. End of document. You didn't learn anything from what you've been through. Oh no. Okay, in chapter three, there's the one thing where we don't make a... Bagus. Don't break the chain. There's a story of a young mother who is haunted by a hungry witch who is after her baby. She ignores all of the warnings and eventually gets her baby eaten by the witch. Spread the word. If you don't forward this message, don't even try to go to sleep. She'll come get you or probably sleep next to you with the round eyes popping out bloody. <sighs> She'll come sleeping next to me? I don't have... I don't have a baby. But, yeah, this is like one of those, like... Forward it to 40 people, or else, you know. <laughs> In the same bed, holding hands. <sighs> the journey, okay. So in chapter 3, if we don't take an action, right? But this is just the one where we run away. Hmm. How lewd, right? Like, imagine the Leia coming at you and she's like about to swipe with the claw and you grab it. And it's like one of those moments where you're kind of just like standing there and you're like holding hands and you're like looking into each other's eyes. <laughs> Is the Leia single? Oh no. <laughs> okay, so we know if we stay here and don't do anything, we get caught. So we have to keep running at the very least. I wonder if there are any like major plot points that change depending oh, on the actions we took. Heck is double bed. <laughs> How many ships? As many as possible. I just want to see. Oh. Okay, we hid in the bushes last time. Let's go behind the walls this time. We're gonna hide behind the walls this time and see what happens here.
Oh. <laughs> no difference. No change. Oh my goodness. ISP Chan. Oh no. Um, OBS is telling me that we are fine right now. Please let me know if uh, if you like refresh and if it helps. It lagged for a little. Oh, a quick little hiccup. Okay, okay. Not too bad. All right, let's keep going. Um, the last, the next one. Ooh, wait, this is a mango, right? Just fell down from the from out there. What if we go this way? Ooh. Some endings and latch on different escapes. Maybe. Okay, let's keep going down this way because we haven't gone down this path yet. What happens here? A signpost. The village, one kilometer. Alternative sign? It's unlocked. I'm not sure I can do this alone. Should I seek help in the village or just go on and end her? Let's go to the village. What happens there? Semoga aku bisa cari bantuan sebelum ada apa-apa. <gasps> oh, what? Too coward to go on. Feeling in despair, Kirana decides to try to help find help from her fellow villagers. She believes that she cannot do this herself and is too worried to go and kill the evil. However, before Kirana can knock on the first door, the creature catches her and erases all hopes for her. Being a coward doesn't bring you any good. Sometimes, being a lone fighter is a wiser thing to do. Howie, how was that being a coward? A never-ending story. Thank you so much for the super chat. Only Shinri would make an uwu loot hand-holding moment out of this. <laughs> Dependent mother, you're doubting your own strength and look where it gets you. Okay. Oh, look. The the image is of her hand, of Kirana's hand, trying to reach for the village for help. Asking for others help only to for failing to survive. Ah. Oh. Yeah, I would think that's like a smart thing to do. The villagers don't have any power. Okay, I guess that's true. According to the lore, she's the one that has that um the the power that's been passed down. So it wouldn't make sense for her to go to the others because they don't have that power either. Yeah, other people don't have that power. I guess it makes sense in that kind of thing. Hmm. Alright, chat. I think we've gotten a good Perodin. Stream with me. <laughs> Hi, I'm a streamer that goes by Gatot to Java S. I have a monthly viewer of more than 2 million. <gasps> 2 million viewers? My subscriber count is more than 5 million. Most of my fans are avid horror gamers. I believe that if I got a chance to play and review your game, your popularity will soar. If you are interested, I would like to inquire for key for you. Oh, come on. If you have 5 million subs and 2 million viewers, you can afford to buy the game and support the developers. Are you asking for a key? You ha you're that huge and you're asking for a free key. Come on. I believe that this will be the good beginning of a relationship between you and I. Can't wait to hear from you. <laughs> oh, come on. At the very least, you can afford it. Okay, chat. I think we've seen a good chunk already of the Layak, and I don't really know what really much the difference there is. So, I kind of want to go and check out the other ones, the Tuyo, because we have to find a way to embrace the Tuyo. We need to find out how to get the Tuyo. How do we do it? I, I thought it was an actual super. <laughs> Because we've only gotten two endings on the. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh. Oh. Yeah, the Leak is the most complete one we've gotten. Oh, wow. 
This is called a lontar. Originally, layak is a way to reach perfection. However, when it falls into the wrong hands, it will become something evil and menacing. It will not be afraid to suck the soul out of a human to get revenge or just to be more powerful. The layak can only be seen at night, and they can change into anything, a monkey, tiger, pig, or other forms. Ooh. The pure soul is needed to make her stronger and reach the highest level. I wonder if like the layak gets more and more powerful the more babies it consumes. Layak is not a ghost. Appears as an ordinary old woman in broad daylight. <gasps> the Layak can appear in broad daylight, but only appears as an old woman? Not a ghost. Very specifically not a ghost. Oh. The dog barking. Yeah, because it says over here... Like, she can turn into other forms. Maybe that's like a sign. Oh, she's a witch. Just a regular witch. Like, not a... Not a spirit. Oh. Eerie. This is a photograph of our home. The daughter's room and the mother's room. I don't see anything else around it. Hmm. A short story. Oh, this is... <laughs> Hang on. <clears throat> the Wicked Witch Who Devours Babies In ancient times, there was an old woman who lived alone in an old hut. She lived deep in the forest known as the Haunted Forest. She had long, messy hair. Her aura seemed different and tense, making no one like to interact with her. Rumors about her magic began to spread when the firewood seeker in the forest saw her meditating until her body could fly. From then on, no one would dare enter the forest alone. At night, on a moonless night, the village atmosphere became so gloomy and sinister. Everyone prepared a talisman, a protector from all distress. It was reported that at night, the old woman would transform into a flying figure that could separate herself from her body. She aimed for the souls of the people who were still pure to become stronger and reach the highest level. That night, a mother accidentally left her baby alone when she needed to go to the, to the kitchen and prepare offerings. At that moment, she came and devoured the baby's soul. When the mother returned to the room, sadly, she had to witness her baby lying lifeless. From then on, protection and awareness of the danger continued to be improved so that there was no more victim in the future. However, danger still lurked as long as the old woman was still alive. People believed that the only way to get rid of her, rid of her was to jab a sharp object into her real body that was left behind. Ah. Maybe this is like... Uh, one of those like folklore stories that just tells you, you know, like if you're a pregnant mother or if you've just recently gave birth, like, you know, take care of your baby. Don't leave the baby alone, especially on a dark night. Moonless night. Oh, yeah. Because in a moonless night, you wouldn't be able to see very well. So it's like a little warning to like new new mothers. Similar tales in Southeast Asia. Sounds like Filipino folklore too. I guess there is a bit of like crossover like that. Also on a full moon, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's a good way to like teach people by just, you know, maybe a, a scary folklore story. My question is, if the real body is left behind, how was the head gone from the body itself? Was it offered as a sacrifice to become immortal? Maybe. I'm not really sure. Pregnant lady should not be alone at night in case something goes after her baby. That's the moral of the story, I suppose. Oh, that eerie place. Oh. It took courage and a strong will to protect her loved one, although she just witnessed something terrible happen to her mother. Oh. Ooh. The 
graveyard. Oh, that's a that's a lot. Of... The graveyard is the place where death beats life. When people die and are cremated in the graveyard, they will be visited by their relative. It is the place where death stayed, yet it is still in the living world. It is the place that reminds us of the circle of life and that life will ev always meet death eventually. Mmm. The Guinness. Ooh. We see this quite a lot in, a, uh, in, a, in the last stories too. We also saw one in the Kuntilanak story too. <sighs> Leak needs a baby to be powerful. Protect the baby at all costs. Only the chosen ones with the powers in their veins, so like a hereditary, uh, like a, a bloodborne power, can put an end to this act. Stab the Leak with the sacred and holy weapon. We don't have that other, the other page that says, do not leave your baby alone. <sighs> that is so cool. The Kedis is a traditional weapon in Indonesia, Malaysia, and Thailand. <gasps> it spread that far? Oh, that's really cool. Wild animals that can get in and harm the baby, yeah. The, Ye the Leak, Kuyang, and Panangal are the same creatures. I, l I like how there's like so much uh, like crossover and like similar stories between each. That's so cool. Okay, chat. Let us go. Um, Kuntil Anak. We have not met the Kuntil Anak too. But, but we do need to go and check out. See if we can figure out a way to embrace the Tuyu. I want to know. I want to see it. We have not seen the Tuyu yet. So, let's go. Tuyu first. And then Kuntil Anak. Alright? We have to get them all, chat. We have to get them all. You want to embrace the two? Yeah, we have to find some of the other um, stories. A young lady who needed quick money for her father's medical bills remembered that she received a huge amount of inheritance from her grandfather who passed away several months before. Feeling desperate, she decided to go to her grandfather's house and took all the things that she could pawn. Little did she know, there was a mystery behind her grandfather's wealth. Ooh. The ritual is kind of complicated. Hmm. Shouldn't be confusing ghosts for Pokemon. No, I thought that we had to capture them. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and skip the conversation because we've already seen it at the beginning, and we've already we know what these are. So, let's go ahead and head over to Grandfather's house. All right, Chad. We've already been through this a couple of times, so I'm going to need your help in trying to figure out how to do the proper ritual. Oh, the sun is already setting. Alright, we gotta take the candle, and we gotta take the bag. And now we can head inside. Find and examine a base, a, a vase. Okay. Yeah. How do I... Door, please. There we go. Door? Oh, you want to screw it. I want to just go through here. Find and examine a vase. Inspect. Oh! A bottom lid. Ah! Oh! Wait. A key? Ashtray. We found a key. Yeah. All right. What do I do with the key? I wonder where the door unlocks. Unlock? Oh. Grandpa's study. Let's see what's inside. A statue. <laughs> <gasps> oh. Book. Wayandi, Indonesia. Shadow puppets. Ah, oh, candy. <laughs> I want to eat the candy. Nice. Grandchild, grandfather loved to, seem to love sweets a lot. Okay, let's throw that away. Door door. 
Nothing inside here. Lowering my volume. Yeah, the laughter is very loud. Huh. Oh. Bookshelf. It's stuck. Pull. Okay. Push. It's movable, but I don't think I'm strong enough. I don't think I'm strong enough. Hmm. Maybe we can take out some of the books to make it lighter? How do we push it? Yeah, isn't Grandpa dead? Yeah, Grandpa is dead. Looks antique, might be expensive. Stationary set. Newspaper. Sugar Cane Factory forced to file for bankruptcy. Wednesday, September 19th, 2001, a sugar cane factory in central Jawa filed for bankruptcy and closed its door permanently for good after more than 20 years of operation since 1980. <gasps> Grandpa's plantation. <gasps> Maybe that's why, chat. The plantation closes because of bankruptcy? And then the grandfather's like, well, I, I still need money. I still need to get money somehow. And then that's when he goes and forms the pact with the Tuyo to get money. By tone and meetings? Mm. Never too late to be rich. <laughs> I'm not sure if you want to. Oh, it's a walking stick. Must be grandfather's. Chair. Move. Ooh, huh. there's a thing under the desk. Huh? Huh? A wooden compartment. Oh, can't open it. Is there a way somehow? Stand back up. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Is there... How do we open it? I I see it, but hmm. From another angle maybe. Oh, oh. Yeah, maybe we can try from this side. No, it doesn't let me go down there. Maybe something on top? Hmm. Bookshelf is still stuck. I don't see any other... Th Ooh. Oh. One key. Two key. Oh, what is this? Maybe this key is important. I'll take it all. Oh. Paper. From your act... Something, something, something from your actions. I'll take Putri with me... Uh, Putri to me with... I don't want her to grow up seeing my grandfather like you. I hope you'll come to your senses. Sincerely, Gatot. It's our father. We know that much. Lamp. Move. Ah, <gasps> handle. Open. Wheel. Turn. Turn this one too. And then. Chat, when did this horror game turn into like an escape room? Oh. <gasps> Key, take. Okay. The statue that fell down. All right. Let us go check. Father's, grandfather's study? Oh. Ooh. Footpath in the middle of a forest, but it's upside down. Painting. Hmm. Gold. Why would grandfather put a scent painting here? It's so weird. What? Are 
Are they supposed to be like all right side up? That looks right. This looks right. These kind of look right. This one is upside down. Like that. Right side up, right side up. Facing up. Oh. There's a few more, but I want to read these first. House deed. Freehold title. Proof of rights. Can't open it. Ooh. Statement of land ownership. The village chief hereby declares that Carsono, the grandfather, yeah. 36. 36? Owning a piece of land located in Wellas Asi village with the following boundaries. Oh, that's so cool. It tells you exactly where the boundaries are. Among these boundaries stand a wooden fence as a land divider. Hereby, the certifi certificate of ownership, this land is made truthfully and is used as appropriate. Interesting. I think this is an amulet. Handwritten letter from someone. Huh? What does it say? In the end, all of this doesn't matter anymore. Why is it covered in blood? Ah, <gasps> grandfather, right? Cursono. Signature and thumbprint of the certificate holder. A farm worker. Hmm. Okay. Let us keep exploring around a bit. Waterfalls down. Waterfalls down. This seems fine. Ah. You. Huh? Wait, it's like... That? Yeah, it looks like a hut. And then this one is upside down too. Whoa. What? I don't get it. It slides, yeah. Hang on, maybe we need to make some space for it? I'm not sure. There's nothing behind it. The painting kind of clips through. I'm not really sure what it's supposed to do with this. Hmm. Yeah, this is a puzzle, but I'm not sure what the puzzle is supposed to be. Are they supposed to be all like upside down, maybe? Let's go check out the stairs first. Keyhole. Ah, <gasps> you need two keys. Oh no, just that very one special one. The office? Ah, <gasps> wait a minute. This is one of the rooms that we weren't able to get into because the door was locked. Yeah, this is the one here. That's the one that was locked. And we couldn't make it in here. What does it say? More news? Sugar factory plays important part in village econ economy. Factory becomes the main money source. Sugar factory saves the village. Sugar factory closed suddenly. Owner is said to be sick and withdrawn from society. <gasps> Grandfather must have really been focused on the fact that... What is that sound? 
Yeah. So grandfather must have like thought to himself like, oh, you know, like I'm like my my plantation saved the village. I'm special. I'm important. Right. But then when it had to close suddenly, it felt like he lost everything. February 1969, I finally married Soemati. Soemati? Su, wait, Su, Sumiati, right? S O E is pronounced as U, so Su, Suma, Sumiati. My love, I'm so happy. March 9th, March. Sumiati started getting angry at me frequently. I know why. I'm poor. I promised her a happy life. <sighs> October, a year afterwards. I'm confused. It's so difficult to work. I work until my bones break and still don't have much money. I think I should find another way. To you. Oh no. A farm worker. I work until my bones break, but I still don't have much money. And then he resorts to the Tuyu. March. So two years afterwards, this Tuyu is true what people said. I'm rich. If only I knew before, I'd use this. And then later that year, my wife starts to be sick, but she's still very young. Suchi, thank you so much for joining the Kui Like Thank you, thank you. My wife starts to be sick, but she's still very young. Maybe it's my fault. She must be so tired taking care of the Tuyu. But there's no other way. <gasps> she's making... He's making her take care of the Tuyu too? August. Being rich is fun. I don't want to be poor again. I know someday I'd have to pay for everything, but I'm ready. That's fine. As long as I could live comfortably. I don't know, chat. I don't know. A phone book. Hmm? Addresses. Nothing particular translates when I'm on there. I don't know, chat. Is it really worth it? That last one? Wait, what's the... Um, what was the significance of the last one? Wingit Cave? Central Jawa? Hmm. I'm not sure. These numbers don't mean any significance to me. I'm not sure if anything... Uh, the last one is a shaman. Oh. MPU? Mbu? Is it like a shaman? A teacher? Oh. Tertayasa? Iwi. Okay. I have to remember this. This is Mbutitayasa's address. I have to remember this. Wait, can we go visit? Do we have time? There's more lore. Schedule for taking care of a human or call him. Um, phone, phone, phone. Mung beans. Journal. Wait, we'll, we'll go next time. We'll go next time. Suimati, list of names. Ambar? Sukinu? Sukinam? You'll get what you deserve. My son's favorite. Play with... What? My son's favorite. Play with mung beans. A glass of milk. Candies, suckle. Grandfather didn't. Grandfather didn't have a son, so who is this? Oh, the Tuyo's favorite. Wait, we ate the candies. We can throw away the mung beans. What else can we do to make it mad? Eat the candies. Throw away the mung beans. A glass of milk and suckle. Glass of milk, glass of milk, where can we find glass of milk? In the kitchen, right? Oh. 
is it possible that this blood is human blood? Advertisement. <laughs> Whoever has a kid is the green holder whose blade is engraved with gold, then they deserve to have great power. Selling a skilled tool for your financial needs. Contact. Oh, it's another shaman. The other one was Tirtayasa. This one is Ardonia. Ardonia. Ar Ardiona. Ardiona. Why would you sell this? That sounds very bad. Gramophone. Turn on. Television. It's not that expensive, old school. Being rich is rad, right? 1982, Suyumari died. I need to find another way. There must be another way. One year has passed. The income is gradual, is decreasing drastically. Breastfeeding is indeed significant. Breastfeeding is significant? The shaman said that I can make it work with offerings, so I tried. Let's see how it goes. Still, it's not bad, but it's hard for making him steal more because he prefers breastfeeding. Can't let things go this way. I have to find a way. I'm starting to lose my grip on him. It's harder to order him to do the stealing. I tried everything I could. 1987, my daughter is the only way. So, 1982, Suimari dies. And then, because the Tuyo is not being breastfed, it doesn't make that much money in all of these. Which is why the grandpa is looking for our mom to try to breastfeed. Oh. Wait. Chat, remember? In the previous run, we went through mom's um, like journal and mom was so sad because she was all like, I'm sorry, I have to go back to my father's plantation. I can't be with you, Katot. Because grandfather ordered her mom back so that he, she could breastfeed. Oh my God. Get your fortune now. More of these advertisements. Grandfather was obsessed with money. Oh, it's getting close to the pawn shop's closing time. That's okay. That's okay. We'll, we'll do it the next time. But for now, lore. I think this is a way to stop having a Tuyo. Cutting ties. Oh. One, prepare empty bottle, ritual flowers, chicken blood, zarafon, zafaron, zafaron oil. Incense benzoin, spoiled eggs, kids' clothes, and a shovel. How to lose toyo perms. <laughs> First, get the empty bottle ready. Collect ritual flowers. Okay, click all of this stuff here. Put them on top of a table in the green room as an offering. Chant this smell to put the toyo back into the empty bottle. Um, Sampun Perna Kapen Kampentinga Gun Kampentinga Kita. I'm sorry, I can't read this. Take a shovel and dig a hole under the mango tree, bury the bottle, and the ritual is finished. Don't chant it. Okay, okay. Jawanese. Okay, don't chant it. Okay, okay. You have to collect a lot of things. I'm not sure if we have time to collect it all before we get like. <gasps> Bottle, empty bottle. Ooh, note. More lore. Don't chant it, it's dangerous, okay. Uh, what are these? Next to village document? From the river? Oh, these are just nearby houses. Addresses of the victims. Oh, yeah. Channeling to 
school membership. No. Oh, I totally forgot, chat. Oh, I forgot there was a timer. Uh, unlock door. I don't have the key. Everything is getting really foggy. Dolls. Very eerie. I love phone. The Toyo is a VTuber. <laughs> Sculpture. Yeah, the fog is getting thick. I think... Ooh. I think this run, we may let it just go, and then... Let's go ahead and just fail this run intentionally so that we can go and read all the lore that we need to. Box. Nothing inside. Children's clothes. Let's go with the disrespect, yeah. Offering, but it's empty. Offering bowl? Must be the ghost place for eating. Receipt. Piece of candy, milk, and mung beans. June 13th, 2001. Dag gonna summon it. I want to see all the endings, so like we're going to get to all of them eventually. Okay, okay. We have... We have some information. Not all of it. Offer breast milk. I don't know if the Tuyo would appreciate... Uh, like, breast milk. From, like, us. This one is locked. Cannot read that. Whose breast milk? I think it's supposed to be mother's. I don't think we can... Hang on, hang on, hang on. Open the door. Go to the pawn shop. Get the heck out. I guess we can't go to the, the shamans. Hmm. It's not funny if the statue could suddenly move by itself. They were facing the other way. Okay, okay. I wonder, chat. Is is everything we need? What are the sounds? It sounds like something's happening upstairs. Let's go upstairs. Upstairs. Hello? Tulio, throw away it. Throw away the toy. I don't hear any... Hmm. It's the Tulio playing around. I... Hmm, I want to try seeing if there's more. What is this? Another one. Will grant you wishes to be rich, job promotion, become a virgin again. More advertisements. Have a desire to be rich? Now it's not merely a dream. <sighs> Grandfather was obsessed with wealth. Oh my gosh. So many advertisements for money. Want a break from the ads, right? Oh. Oh, this. <laughs> I saw the blood on there. Okay, let's take a seat. Let's see what happens. Step off? No, let's just sit here and wait. Yeah. I guess there's nothing else that happens. We'll have to get off first. Maybe we have to finish the offering first. And then we have to go take a seat. 
Hmm. Child's mobile. I think we've seen everything that there is to see in this room. Unlock the door, but we don't have the key for this one. Okay. The amount of kid statue equals to the amount of tears the grandpa has. Wait, you can have more than one to you? That sounds intense. Like, what if one to you per... Ah, oh, wait, where's the kitchen? One to you per... <gasps> uh oh Wow. Oh, it's so... Unlock door. Oh, there's so much smoke. I can't see anything, chat. I'm so sorry. Oh, no. The fog is a little bit crunchy, yeah. Light the candle in inventory? How do I do that? Oh, there we go. Candle. Light. Honestly, it does not help that much. Okay, we're looking for the kitchen, which, if I remember, is like around here. Milk. Where's the milk? Milk, milk, milk. Wine? No. No. Ah, milk. Chemist milk. How do I get rid of it? Milk carton here. Oh, I guess we already drank it. Limby. Oh, it's so... I, oh gosh, chat. I can't see anything. And then outside is just worse. I'm pretty sure children are Tuyo, though. Uh, chat, I have no idea what's going on. It's too like foggy to see anything. Is there a bad ending here? <laughs> okay, so the only two things that we haven't done are drink the milk, which you can't interact with, and then suckle, which I don't want to let the two year suckle me. Like, we're not married yet, so I can't see anything. Oh gosh, I hate this. Hmm, paper that's been torn. I mean me as in like the the main character. <gasps> what? Oh, I don't know if the, the fog is like intentionally supposed to be like this, but I can't see anything. Ooh, yeah. I mean like me as in like the, the main character, you know? Not me as in like Mimi. Uh chat, I'm not sure what I'm supposed to do. It's much too dark. I can't see anything, chat. I can't see anything. <laughs> There's a joke to be made there, perhaps. But right now, I'm more confused. I, I hope the smoke thing is not, like, intentional. Because I really can't see anything with all the smoke. Settings. Um, Post-processing. Let's turn that to normal. And turn shadows to normal, too. Effects back to normal. Let's see if that helps a little bit. No, the smoke is just absolutely... Yeah, maybe it's a bug, yeah. Fog is way too strong. After the release, Dev was about to change it, but they kind of abandoned it now. Oh. So this is supposed to be intentional. It's just like... Very, very bad. My eyesight. The fog shouldn't be like this. It's bugged. Okay. Let me go change it to like low texture. Turn this off. 
Karma, Depth of Field. No, that's still pretty bad. Can we change it to like anti-alias and V-Sync? Ocean Blur? Continue. No, that's still pretty bad. <laughs> okay. I think we may have to restart the run because I don't know if there's anything else that happens besides it just getting very, very foggy. I haven't seen, like I hear the tuyo every now and then. But I don't, I haven't seen anything, so I don't know if like anything happens. All right, let's get the heck out of here. Hmm. Oh, we can't see anything. Can you remove the motion blur? Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah. <clears throat> Alright, we'll go back in, but we'll change it. Ooh. The bunker in the backyard? There's an ending where you walk away from the house through the way you came in. Okay, we'll have to check those out. Eating his food. Don't eat carelessly, especially if it's not in yours. The candy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Discarding his favorite toy? Mm hmm. You make it angry. Good. I wanted to make it angry. Reading other people's stuff without permission. Grandfather is dead. Excuse me. Throwing away useful things. Dumping away favorite toy. Being nosy for no good reason. Throwing away important things. Playing a strange musical instrument. Some things aren't meant to be played. There's a whole area you haven't been in yet. Yeah. Disposing a loved one's belonging. Discarding things that belong to someone else. There's a lot here, but we're going to go back and let me go ahead and change the settings real quick. Settings, turn off motion blur, turn off anti-aliasing. Everything will be the normal. Okay. All right. Let's go back into it. One more time. Feels like these ghost stories are mostly don't be rude. Yeah, I think they're like folklore in the sense that they're there to kind of teach you a lesson or give you guidance on how to not um, like anger the ghosts and all that. Permission from the dead, you're saying the graveyard or something? Maybe. That's in the, in the title, Pamami. Yeah. All right, let's go ahead and skip the document or the, the dialogue here. And then go to grandfather's house. I wonder if we can go and loot everything in the house. Take all the items which locked. Yeah, I think we mentioned that. Yuki, thank you so much for joining the Koi Life Day. Welcome, welcome. All right, so... We're gonna loot. We're gonna try looting this time. Unlock the door. Go inside. We're gonna grab the vase. Inspected. Gonna go here. Open that up. Take the key. Nice. Now we have the key to grandfather's study. Unlock. 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 Ignore that. We don't have time. All right. Let's go and. Candy, book, inspect, and statue, drawer, drawer, nothing here. Pull that. I'm going to move this to the side. Move the chair. Go underneath the desk. Open this. Slide lock. Open compartment. Can't open. Oh, wait. We got to do the, the thing, other thing first. Stand back up. There's a lot of like uh, noises that are being slammed open. And Come on. Come on. Wheel. Turn. <laughs> Speed run, right? Okay. Get back under the desk. Grab the key to the cellar. I, I get it. I get it. Calm down. All right. Now we head over here. Decoration. Mm, no. Upstairs, though. 
ain't got time for paranormal activity, right? We have things to sell. And we need money for our father's... Uh, our father's uh, surgery. Okay. Go here. Take the radio. Take the gramophone. We're going to take the whole TV. Wow, she's really strong. Shelf. Move. Nice. Is there anything that we can take from here? Mm, I don't think so. I think this is all the valuables here. Uh, paper, journal, notes. No. Can't take the clock. All right. Well, we have a few things from here. So let's go ahead and grab the other stuff. A whole TV in the bag, right? Okay, now we come over here and we loot the regular stuff, including take the sword. We'll take this sword too. And then we got to come over here, click the radio. <laughs> Imagine if you're the Tuyo and you're just trying to scare, uh, scare the main character. And then you see her just doing this, like sprinting around the house. TV, can't take that. And then you're like, Boo, wait a minute, what are you doing? Like, why, why are you taking everything? Are, are you not scared of me? And they're like, we don't even pay attention. How big are her pockets, right? Take that. Take this radio. Oh wait, I take the cigars too. And then... Shoes, no, we can't take these. There's nothing to take over here, but I think there's something over here valuable. Is there money? There's cash envelope, but we can't take that. Radio, can't take that one either. Alright, now to head upstairs and we're gonna go <laughs> Tuya watching us looting speedrun. <laughs> okay, okay. Upstairs into mom's room, and then from mom's room, we're going to steal all the valuable stuff here too. Uh can we take this? Ceramic? No. Where was mom's jewelry again? More Tuyo statues. Shroud. Flower. Black sticky rice. Ooh. Faucet. Turn on. I'm gonna take a shower real quick before we continue to steal everything. A thief entered a haunted house and was imprisoned there for weeks. Oh no. Okay. Can't open that one. Where was mom's room again? Oh, ooh, the gem. Take the gem. The sky is getting darker. I should hurry. Ah, here we go. Jewelry box. Open. Take the ring. Wedding rings are usually expensive. Take earring. Take earring. Take the brooch. This should be enough, right? Take the necklace. How much more can we steal? Grab a phone. Um, I think we've already taken most of the valuables here. And unlock door. Can't open this one. Just take the entire gramophone. Yeah, that's the whole thing. All of it. Mm, nothing to steal here. <laughs> nothing to steal specifically. Okay, I don't think there's anything else. At least nothing that we can um, like access very easily. Can I steal the statue? Unlock the door? We don't have the key for this one, and we never found the key to this room. Alright. I think this might be a good chance. Technically, we don't steal. Yeah. <gasps> oh my god. Oh. oh, that spooked me. That spooked me.
door lock. Unlock the door. We have so many keys, but we don't have... It's a jump scare again. Yeah. We have so many keys, but we don't have anything that can, like, open those. <gasps> Another gramophone. Bung beans. Marbles. Photo album. Huh. Interesting. There's two black keys in this office. Um, do we need the two black keys in order to uh, find any more loot? Speed. Okay, let's go back up one more time. Yes, you do. Oh, it's the one thing you can't replace. <laughs> Okay, move the chair? Drawers. Not that one. Um, wait, chat, remind me where they were. In the study table. Oh, in the study table. The study, study. Pawn shop, dad. Okay, I'm gonna wait until she mentions that the pawn shop is going about to close. Okay, two keys. Take, take. And now we can go and open the other doors, right? Like here. Unlock. Run. Ah, <gasps> jewelry. Yeah. Okay, let's go take... Take the ring. Take the ring. Hairpin. Hairpin. Oh my god, this is gonna take forever. Let me, let me... Ah, oh, I have to like, so carefully aim. Okay, drawer, oh, watches, and then over here, necklace, what, switch, no, ring, okay, I know there's lore, but we can't, not yet, not yet, TV, <laughs> open drawer door, Clothing. Marbles. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <gasps> A safe. Money. There's gotta be money here. Open. <gasps> Golden bars. Gold bars. We'll look at the photos later. Okay. Quick, quick, quick. Any more? Any more? No. Nothing here. I think there's one more place that we haven't gone to, and it's the room upstairs. Oh, it's getting dark. Oh no. I know it's the days of grandfather's stuff. If only father let me come to this house. Here we go, here we go. Unlock. What's in here? Drawer? No loot. Drawer? No loot. Drawer? There's so many things in here, chat. Ooh, pills. Marbles. Uh, last one down there. Nothing. Wardrobe. What? Oh. Ah! <gasps> Wait. The key isn't working. Wait, we had to change the key? Ooh. Okay, we'll have to come back here. We're running out of time, unfortunately. Sleepy Penguin, welcome. Thank you for joining the collective. Okay, last one is over here. We don't have the key for this one. We have to go through the other side. All right, I think you can customize the key in the inventory. Okay, we'll do that next time. I think we may have enough money, but it's getting dark. You can see the... What the heck? What? Why is that door locked? Wait. Since when was this here? Oh, uh, I think this should be enough. This should be enough. Yeah, let's... Let's get out of here. 
All right, let's go. Please tell me this is enough to go to the pawn shop and raise money for our father's surgery. Take the store swords. Yeah, we already take the swords. Come on, let's see how much money we make. Enter the pawn shop. It's got to be enough to 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 take care of our father, right? Receipt consists of list of items that are pawned and the total amount of loans. All right, here we go. Forty-four point eight million. Okay, Chad, look at everything that we collected. Look at all of that. Is this enough? Is this enough? 44 million. So the first time we only got like 350,000. And then the next time we got like 5 million. And now we got 44 million. Let's see, is it enough? Are you serious? 44 million and it's not enough? You need 50 million? 50 million? Oh. Where do you even find the others? I thought we got all of them. You still gotta summon the tool. Oh, there's so many things we have to do. We have to summon the tool. We have to make enough money. We have to also figure out a way to banish the tool. Take another TV. Tool yield milky, milky milk time. <laughs> all right, all right. Need a hundred million. I don't know if we can get a hundred million. Tool is holding the rest of the cash. Okay, okay. More TVs, more radios, and more uh, gramophones. All right. Someone mentioned the secret vault. We did have that one key that we didn't get to. Take candle, take bag. Okay, now we go. Run. Do, 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 do. Unlock door. The statue's moved. Okay, yeah. Let's go inspect this. Turn that. Grab the key. And then go here first. Unlock the door. Run inside. And then take the gramophone. There's nothing else that we can take here. Open. Open. Turn. Oh, wait, I gotta do the thing. Pull. Turn. Yeah, we're gonna ignore everything and focus on trying to get as much money as possible to see if we can raise. Slide the lock. Open. Oh. I'm oh, doing them in the wrong order. Turn. I have to be very, like, accurate with these. Okay, take the key. Stand up. The house is an escape room. It really is. Let's take this key. Take this key. And then we'll work our way backwards. So we'll go through here. Climb up. Upstairs. Unlock the door. Open. Anything in the drawer that you might room? Not that I've noticed. Not that I noticed. Okay. Radio. Take the radio. Take the gramophone. Take the TV. And I don't think there's anything else. We can take the bottle. I don't think there's anything else that we really need to use. We can open this, but there's nothing inside here that we can take. So, at this point, this room has already been looted. <laughs> And now we come to the main room again. The main house. So yeah, see? This path is open. It's not boarded up. Go ahead, take the sword. Take the sword. How does it all fit in your pockets? We have big pockets. In here. Um, wool. 
We can't take this TV, but we can't take the radios that are outside. Right? Oh, wait. Radio. Take radio. Cassettes. Trophy. We can't take these. Oh, wait. There's more swords. One sword. Two swords. Nice. Can't take those. We've already read these last time. Gramophone. Cigar. Radio. And then in here. Bathroom. Nothing. Kitchen. I guess we can take this little fruit. Uh, excuse me. Cooking oil. Can't take that. There's this room here, which I don't believe has anything valuable. We don't want to take a shower yet. Clothes? Do, do, do. And there's nothing in here, is there? Just double checking. Hammer. Oh, wait. Can't take that radio, yeah. Um. Chat, I don't remember if there's anything else specific that I need to be collecting from downstairs. Okay, we got those we got those rooms. Something in the toilet? I don't I didn't see one anything in the toilet. Unlock this door, head in here, and then all the jewelry is what we need to get from here. Ah, no. Be very careful. <laughs> there we go. Get the necklace. Oh no. I don't have much time before the pawn shop closes. Oh jeez. Already? Okay. Key. Unlock. Let's get the gold. Check the rug on the side of the house. Gold bar, gold bar. There's nothing in here, right? Open the curtain. Bathtub, take a bath. No, that wastes time. Uh oh. Ooh, another box. Nothing in here. You need to be frame perfect to pick them. You kind of have to like have the cursor directly pointed on top of him. Take this radio too. I think now this might be enough because we did get an extra two swords. Nothing. Hmm. The TV. I don't want the key. Oh, wait, there's nothing in there because we go from the other side. Okay. Uh. Take the brooch. Eerie. Eerie. Oh, the music playing is eerie. Take the locket. And I think that's it. Here. Gramophone. Sorry, chat. I'm focusing a little bit. <laughs> what about the evil gemstone? Yeah, chat. Don't forget the gemstone. Okay. Got the gemstone. Over here. Unlock. Uh oh. Okay, we know that there's nothing in there, but there's one thing over here. Move the clothes. Inventory. 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 Where's inventory? Uh. Funny key. Just there we go. This should be enough to open this door, right? Ah, <gasps> sculpture button. Nothing happens. There's lore. Oh no. Okay, can't do anything here, but we gotta go. We gotta go. We'll come back later. 
We're running out of time, chat. We have to sell all of our goods so that we can raise money for our father's uh, surgery. We got a couple of extra things. Will that be enough? Can't pick these sculptures? No. The coats in the notebook. Yeah, we'll do, we'll we'll do all of that later. <laughs> okay, pawn shop before it gets too late. I think you forgot the watches. Oh no, that's right. Oh, we forgot the watches. I don't think it's enough. Yeah, we forgot the watches. There was another TV there too that we couldn't get to. Oh, that was even worse. Seven million. The TVs, yeah. One of the TVs can be taken. Oh, uh, no, that was very, very worse. <laughs> okay, chat, give me just a moment. And I must go to an aisle meeting real quick because I've been hydrating. <gasps> Startled me a bit. I really want to find more for all of these. I'm really glad we were able to compile so much data for the Leag, but we were still so far behind. Okay, I'm gonna leave you all here with this nice little uh, spooky music. I'm gonna go to the idle meeting real quick and I'll be right back, chat. Ah. <gasps>
Hello chat, I am back. Sorry that took a little longer than usual. I decided to go and order some food because I am very hungry. <laughs> ah, I am back. Hello, oh thank you so much for the super chat. Father Sin possessed someone get the salt. Wait, what was going on? What? You kept moving? What? My model was moving? Making me check around here because... <laughs> it's moving no cab? Seriously? What? No, you, you, there has to be like a face. There has to be a face like to be, to be like captured. <laughs> it moved on its own. Maybe it was just like settling down. Like if it does like, if it, if I go like to the side and just close my eyes, it just kind of does that. Like, was it that? Look at your ceiling. Nothing up, nothing up there. <laughs> okay, I... I, I trust you, Chad. <laughs> Please tell us if you forgot to pause it. Pause what, Chad? Just watch the VOD. Okay, we'll, we'll, we'll check out the VOD. We will check out the VOD. Alright, your face moves from left to right. Like this? I don't know. <laughs> All right, chat. All right. Um, there's a lot of things we need to do. We have no actual results from this one. It needs a face. Then whose face was it? <laughs> Thank you for the super chat channel. Okay, since we are here, since we are here, let's go back and do the tuyo thing. But we're gonna do the entire ritual. So. Let's let's not worry about the money. Let's just go and try and see if we can solve the mystery behind the tool first. Try to find the trapdoor beneath the carpet at the TV room. Ooh, a trapdoor. All right. Second time it happened both of the Pamali Street. <laughs> Lex passport and visa just got accepted. Oh no. <laughs> All right. Door, grandfather's house. We're not going to loot anything. But what we're going to do is go and figure out exactly what is going on. Skip. The only thing we really need is the candle. Um... Grandfather's house, collect as many valuables. We don't really need this somewhere right now. We're gonna go ahead and keep the candle. All right. Let us go check out little statues of children. They're still facing the right direction. Okay. The house smells unique, typical of an old house. All right, so the first couple of things we need to do, open this and get the key from here. And then that unlocks grandfather's study room. With this open, we're able to come over here and unlock the, uh, the little things by the door. So pull that out. Move this chair, move this lamp, lift open the handle, turn this wheel to open the... Yeah, we're going full lore this time. This one is locked, and we can't do anything yet until we first flip this... <sighs> I know it's going to happen, but it, it still spooked me. <laughs> now we can go and open it. Check under the desk. Under the un, under the desk, then grab this key. Stand back up. All right. 
we still haven't solved this specific puzzle here. Guessing this is our grandfather. When I was still a farm worker, me in 1967. Hmm. Carsono and Su Su Sumiyari. Carsono and Sumiyari. All right. All right, so let's see if we can solve this puzzle here. Rotate, rotate, rotate. Actually, this one looks like it's this way up, correct. Turn, turn, turn. Make it into a circle? I don't know what that means. Rotate, rotate. There we go. And this one is incorrect. There we go. Uh, this one looks like it is upside down. The picture in the painting. No. Get back over here. Around this way. Is that what we're supposed to do? Like make it a big circle, like the the images. This one looks like it's upside down. Uh, this one is right side up. Make a big circle. Hang on a minute. Textures. Let's increase the textures a bit. Maybe that'll help us see. Like when you see a circle, do you mean like? The lines, like this, like it kind of curves like that, which means curves like this over here. And then it'll continue to curve. The white is on the inside, right? Okay, so it curves like that. Is this where more loot is? A ring. Ring is too ancient. The price won't be high. Notes. There lies a great amount of power hidden inside the gemstone on this ring. As long as we take care of it and give it offerings, this ring will protect us from harm and give us fortunes. Is this ring by itself worth it? Need something to carry these with. The magic ring. Okay, so there's a ring here, and we need to make it a big circle with this, all right? So we'll, we'll remember that next time. But what is this one here? Does this one do anything? Yeah, we did, we're not gonna go for the back. We're not gonna go for the back yet. I'm, I'm just gonna go and like, um, what was it? Uh, we're going to go and collect or like unlock where all the locations are first so that we can do a proper run through because right now I'm kind of like scrambling around. So we want to find where all of the, the valuables are. Every single one of them. Okay. So we have this radio that we can collect. This radio, the gramophone and the TV. And then, anything else here? Yeah, we need to solve that number puzzle too. Hmm. Offering bowl. Pants, shirt. Throw away the shirt. What is that sound? Can't collect this painting. Look, no. Oh yeah, don't worry about the fact that we don't have the bag. 
I just want to go around and make sure we can find all the locations first. So move that chair. Drawer. Phone book. Someone took this photo because maybe the bottle is important. A bottle? It looks like it's on some kind of a round table. Some kind of a round table? A round, round table. Ah, <gasps> The tuyo is inside the table. Yeah, but maybe we should go check out the outside tables real, uh, real fast. So we know that there's a ring inside there. We can't collect this. There are swords here that we can collect. One, two. And then over here, there are two more swords. These two. Gramophone here. Radio and cigar here. Plates. I don't see anything else that we can collect from here, unless it looks like it's just the photo, it's a photo of grandfather. Hot water container. Yeah, there's nothing here. So it's just these two objects, radio, cigar, and then the gramophone over there. And then let's keep searching around. That's the bathroom has nothing inside it. Have you checked the base? Wait, there's a basement? Unlocked door? Ah, oh, we can't go outside yet. Where's the basement, chat? Are there no... I don't think there's any keys here. It's just these photos. Basement in the TV room. In the TV room. Okay, thank you, chat. Thank you, thank you. Let us go find... In the TV room... Under the carpet, right? <gasps> I think I can roll the carpet. Whoa. Okay, so we need to go and adjust the key first. This one will be for this side. Unlock. And then the other one, we just want all four prongs out. So like, like that. Oh. oh, there's so much stuff. Okay, piggy bank. Things inside must not be that important. Don't know what it contains. Okay, so there's a piggy bank here. Ooh. Piggy bank. Okay, there's two piggy banks you can collect. Photo album. Some kind of like a burial ritual, it looks like. Like these look like gravestones. Hmm. Oh, I like this one. It's purple. This must be our mother. Cutlery. Okay. And a gemstone. All right, so one, two piggy banks here. Gemstone and cutlery we can collect. 1978. Why are all these shattered like this? Ooh. What? A plaque. It means open this if you are ready and sure.
exercise paper. What? Name Ambar Corsono. Huh? What? I <laughs> draw pictures of these Ramayana characters. Rama. Oh no. Story of Rama. I want to read it once before, but I want to read it again. Ah. Uh, it's going to take a long time. I think we'll, these symbols will be useful in the hallway next to you. Ooh. Okay, let's go check it. Oh, no, chat. We can already see the fog coming in. Okay. It's a very deep passage underground. This tunnel will get me lost. No way, I can't get lost. Ooh. Okay. Let us go and check out these areas here. Sandbags. Hmm. All right, so we go this way. So we go down the hall to the right. Ah. Ah. Padlock. Inspect. Are you... King Darasata, who ruled the kingdom of Ayoda, Ayodhya, had four sons named Rama, Baharata, Laksmana, and Sarchu, Sarchugna. Oh, jeez. Are these in? Bow and arrow. Sandals. Puppy. Uh, twins. Let's try it. Let's try it. Bow and arrow. Sandals. Puppy. Twins. <gasps> Ooh. Okay. Chad, this is very extreme. What happens if we go all the way straight down? What the hell is this place? Huh? Padlock. The story here is Rama went back to the kingdom and was ready to be crowned, but Ki Kai Kei, his stepmother, said the Dasarata. Asanata has promised to crown her, her crown to Bharata as the next king. Uh, did you take the paper? Oh my gosh. I, you know what? Here. I, chat, I'm going to cheat a little bit. Let's find a way out of here first. I'm just going to go ahead and take a screenshot. Yeah, I want to take a screenshot of the paper. Because this is going to take us a long, long time if we go, keep going back and forth. So, oh, we can take it. Oh my gosh, this is going to take a long time. Okay, maybe we don't need a screenshot because we can take it. So, they're on the wall. It's just all washed away. I saw a few on the wall. I'm not sure in which order it is, though. That's the thing. So, like, here we have the puppy, right? And then we have the sandals, bow, bow again, and then the queen, king, Sandals. See, that's way too many. So I don't know in which order it is. All right. Padlock inspect. Rama went back to the kingdom, was ready to be crowned, but Kaikeyi said that Dasarata was promised the crown Paratha. 
Rama, Kaikeyi, Dasaratha, and Bharatha. Rama, the bow, went to... Hey, Battle of Alkan. Thanks for stopping by. Bring out the castle. <laughs> Let's see. Rama was here. And then Kaikeyi, Dasaratha, promised it to Bharata. Bow, Queen, King, Sandals. Bow, Queen, King, Sandals. There we go. Ah. Uh, oh gosh. Let's go to the first one so that we don't get lost. <gasps> Oh, <laughs> the stuff must be inside is valuable, so they put a door here. Oh. Ooh. I think it can be played. You have got to be kidding me. Are you serious? I had to play that too? Might be a way to open the door. Tingal karita hu. What? Maksudnya? Apa? How do I... Oh, jeez, I can already see the smoke. How am I to <laughs> straight up escape room? It really is at this point. I don't even know what the melody is. Okay, inspect. In the forest, Sarpan, Sarpa Kane, Kanaka? Sarpa, Sarpa Kaneka, Sarpa Kanaka, Sarpa Kanaka, seduce Laksmana, exchange yourself into a beautiful woman. He was suspicious of her and caught her nose. As a result, the people of Alenka, a kingdom ruled by Rath Rawana, Sarpakemaka, Laskmana, Alenka, Rawana. Um, Sarpakemaka, lips, L Laksmana, lips, puppy, Alenka, Alenka, Alenka. People of Alenka. Okay, there we go. People. So lips, puppy, people. And then Ravana, Ravana, Ravana. Ogre. Lips, puppy, people, and ogre. Wait, but ogre with a halo, right? I think it's this one. Ah, oh, nice. All right, let's see if we can find. You have got to be kidding me. You've got to be kidding me. There's so many puzzles, chat. Oh my God. No. How do I know which gate is the right one? Oh my god. Okay, we're just gonna keep going until we hit the furthest one. Oh no. Okay, so this is the room. Oh my god. Okay, let's try this. <laughs> Dasaratha granted the wish because he wanted to fulfill the promise. Ramata, Shinta, and Lakshmana left the palace and went to exile in Dadang, Danka, Dandaka Forest. Dandaka Forest. Um, Dasaratha, Rama, Shinta, Lakshmana, Danaka Forest. Dandaka. Dandaka. What? Dasaratha, king? King, Rama, Shinta, Laksmana. Rama, Shinta, Laksmana. Rama, 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 Rama. So King, Bo, Laksmana, King, Bo, Puppy, Shinta. King, Bo, Puppy, Crown. But in what order? King, Bo, Puppy, Crown. It is 
King bow crown puppy. King bow crown puppy. There we go. Dead end. Oh, it's like right there. Oh, I need something to carry this with. I can, I can. Oh, wait. I can collect it from here. Oh. Do you think Grandpa got rich by having Tweedle steal from others and he got paranoid by others steal from him? And he built this escape room of a house. Oh, Doomshot, you're right. That might explain why he has all these like puzzles going around. Oh. I like that. I like that theory. Okay, so we can reach it from here. I need something to carry this. So, do you, Chad, do you guys think that might be enough? Should we just head back for now? We can head back. And then maybe we can try solving this puzzle later on. Because I think we're kind of out of time at the moment. Like, there's just so much fog. Now MC needs something to carry with. Yeah. Okay, so... Let me go double check upstairs real quick. I want to go see... Something that we can... No, no, we can reach the spear from the... Uh, from the grate. The fog triggered by certain items. No, the fog is actually just like uh, a timer. Okay. In this room, radio, gramophone, TV. That's the only three objects we need to collect from here. Radio, gramophone, TV. And then there's nothing else. So I think we're pretty good. Eight minutes or something? Mm. Radio, gramophone, TV. And then everything else is on the ground floor. So... I think we have a good idea. The spirit is setting up fog machines. <laughs> Far door behind the house near the fields. Is there one? A little clock on the table? Okay, chat, let me go back and check. This little clock? Oh! Looks antique, might be expensive. Okay, okay. Alright, thank you, chat. Thank you, thank you. Go to the bunker. We were there on the first stream. I think we... Champaka. Yeah. I think when we went in around the back... Um, yeah, the fog isn't like too, too, like, snappy. Hmm. Oh, that's right, Chad. We went, but it was, it took a long time. I don't know if we have the time to run all the way over to... Um, ah, here we go, the plantation fields. I don't know if we have time to go all the way to the bunker that we came across here. Unless we go straight for it. So, run into Grandpa's study, take the key, and then run over here. We don't have the key for this one. Where would we find the key for that? Hmm. Yeah, too many keys. I don't know where all the keys are. <laughs> hmm. Is it really possible to do all of this in just eight minutes? I don't think that's possible. I think what we need to do is focus on the most valuable objects. Maybe you need to finish exploring the bunker. We could go there, yeah, we can go to that. Chat, I didn't expect this this level here to be so intricate and have so many things. We missed so much of it early on. There's a red book with a question mark, but I forgot what it was. But the key would be the puzzle, but that's not it. Mm. Oh, that looks so huge. <laughs> All right. 
maybe you can take notes in the bunker. Oh, that's what we should have done. That's what we should have done. To memorize at least the symbols in the order that they show up in. So we go here and then... Ah, the lock is gone. Okay, wait. Let me get a... Let me get my pen and paper out, chat. Okay. Not try mapping. Yeah, I want to try to go ahead and map out the, the maps that we got. And then there's one lock here. And then... We go this way, straight forward. All the way to the top. And there's another one here. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Let me go and properly measure out. We open this gate. There is a right turn. We have not explored this area. Keep going forward. There is a left turn. We have also not explored this area. Keep going forward. And then there is a second left turn, which we also have not examined yet. And then go through one more time. And we have a third left turn with another lock but this here third left turn we can actually go over here and reach through to collect the valuable so our arms can actually get through and like reach through it so this is one potential area that we can go for but this is the lot that we also need to unlock after we get through this second lock, we can go into the main chamber, which has this bar, this musical bar that we don't know the, the combination to, because you have to play it in a very specific way. <laughs> um, and there's a left turn beyond that. Play Omogus. Oh, left turn, lock. Keep going. And then we have our very first cross section here. But this has a dead end on the right. We haven't checked out the lower left-hand side yet. And then right after the first cross, the crossroads, we have a another lock and another alleyway that we have not checked yet. Let me go inspect this one. Sarpakanaka Sarpa Sarpa went to Rawana asking for his help to Avenger, convinced him to kidnap Shinta. He agreed to ask Marika to change himself into a golden deer. Hmm. Sarpa, Sarpa Kanaka, Rowana, Shinta, Marika. Sarpa Kanaka. Sarpa Kanaka. Lips went to Shinta, Right? Rowana. So lips, ogre, crown, deer. Lips, ogre, crown, and then deer. Lips, uh, lips, ogre, crown, Deer. Let me just write that down so that the next time we can travel through here. And then we go all the way down here. Takes us to... Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Another crossroads with more stories. Chad, what is this? What on earth? <laughs> Dead end with bottles. Alcoholic drinks. <sighs> and this has a lock. 
I don't I don't know if I could do this tonight, Chad. I don't know if I could do this tonight. <laughs> Dama and Laksmana encountered the goddess child called Durga Dur, Durga Bahu. He advised that they should go to Mount uh Res Resma Res Yamuka. I have no idea how to pronounce this one. The mountain, and then help the monkey king Sugriwa. Rama, Laksmana, Durga Bahu, and then the mountain. We, I, I really do want to go for the lore because this is like this is so involved. Um. Wait, I totally just. Oh no. Rama is the bow. We know that much. And then Laksmana is the puppy, right? Laksmana is the puppy, yeah. The puppy. And then they went over to check the story. There's 14 locks. Wait. <gasps> Oh, this is a lot easier. This is a lot easier. Okay. Rama, Puppy, and Laksmana encountered the goddess child called uh, Monkey King. Ogre. Ogre with the halo. Ogre with the halo. So it'd be Bo, Puppy, Ogre with the halo, and then Monkey King. Oh my gosh, chat. That is so much easier. It's so much easier. Thank you. I should have paid more attention to that. Okay. With all the help he could get, Rama finally battled Rama. It starts with Rama and killed Rowana. With all the help that Rama, Rama, Ogre, Monkey King, but with Rama all together and the crown. Okay, so Rama, Ogre, and then together, oh, I missed it, together, and then the crown. Oh, did I get the wrong one? With all the help he could get, Rama finally battled and killed the Ogre, told the, what, about her husband's triumph? Wait, what? Rama finally built, finally battled and killed Rwana. Rama killed Rwana. And then Aonoman told Shinta about her husband's triumph. Isn't that right? Or is it the other one? That's a monkey? It, it should, wait, this one? No. Wait, am I reading it wrong, chat? Over here, right? So, Rama, and then the ogre, and then the monkey and the bow together. The monkey and the bow. And then the, the crown. Oh, is the ogre wrong? The ogre king. Okay, so... No, it looks the same. So we have the bow, and then the ogre king, and then the monkey and the bow, and then the crown. Huh? Eh? The... Right? Wait, I'm... Am I... Huh. Bow, ogre king, monkey, crown. Bow, Ogre King, Monkey, Crown. Try to scroll from the bottom side. Hmm? Is there...
maybe we had to like line it up with a different section of the thing. So like, like right here. I can't click on that though. How much do they spend on these custom locks, right? Monkey King and then the crown. Nothing happens. One, 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 one. Nothing. One, 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 one. Nothing. I'm pretty sure the combination is right, but. Hmm. One, 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 one. Do I have to solve them in order first, chat? It doesn't make sense because the other ones let me through. Try going backwards. Okay, so hang on. Let's reset this. Inspect. Okay. So we can start with. Yeah. Rama, Ogre King, the monkey with the bow, and then the crown backwards. Nothing happens. Maybe the wrong king symbol? Okay, let's reset. Rama. Ogre king. Monkey. Crown. Check the walls beside you. It's the king. Monkey king. Is it ogre king first? Ogre King first and then bow? Maybe that's why. Ogre King first and then the bow. Monkey with the bow and then crown. Oh, the story is wrong. It's in the wrong order. These two should have been flipped. The, the Ogre King here and then the Rama. Ah, okay. And then... Okay, so here, maybe the maybe the pictures on the walls are more accurate. Something valuable that can change life. Okay. Crown. Monkey. Bow. Puppy. Maybe the, the images on the wall are more accurate. Crown. Monkey. Bow. Puppy. Okay. How many more? Bow, crown, puppy, monkey. Bow, crown, puppy, monkey. And then, Gaining ownership. Oh. Gaining ownership. Wait. Candies, marbles, ritual flowers, chicken blood, zafaron oil, incense, spoiled eggs. Make sure the toil is free. First, chant the spell. Collect candies, marbles, and put them into the chest on top of the green room. Oh. The bottle is weird. It's probably something. Oh. No way. It's real. The to you is real. Okay, now what do I do though? But I can't take the bottle. Take the lid off? Can I aim at the lid? No, it doesn't let me do anything. It doesn't let me take it either. It's just look and inspect. Maybe the top of the bubble? No. I... I can't take it while inspecting. Inspect and then shake it. Okay. Ah, oh, bottle cap. Oh. Apa itu? Oh. 
take. Okay, let's let's get back out of here. Oh, jeez, I don't know if I remember the way back. Oh, wait, this is new. What? A note. I'm not sure I can understand that. There's no translate option either. It just tells me this. Something says releasing it, but it's a bad idea. I think so too. But at this point, we are too far in. Let's go back out to the main room. Uh, this way. And then, I don't know, what are we supposed to do? Oh, wait, this way. Uh, ah, okay. Here we go, here we go. Maybe after you release it, you want to, you might want to do the ritual. Oh, wait, we have to do the cleansing ritual though, right? Is it going to? Jump at us? Uh, oh no, Jet. I'm like super hungry. And I'm also very tired. Okay. <laughs> it's here, isn't it? Inspect. This one, this one. Cutting ties of the Tuyo. Bottle, ritual flowers, chicken blood. I get the feeling that these are very similar steps to becoming joining the Tuyo. Eat. Uh... Okay, chat. Is it okay if we call it here for today? Because we kind of know what we're supposed to do. And I already have my notes written down. So we can try this next week. We can try this next week, but we know how to do this. So now that we know how to get through all the maze, we got two things. We have um, forming a bond with the Tuyul, and we have cutting ties with the Tuyul. So we need to go through both of these ritual steps. No, Kunti Chan. Okay, we can see, we can go visit Kunti Chan later. Okay. <laughs> uh, we made so much progress, though, Chad. Oh my gosh. Ah, this is really exciting, Chad. <laughs> okay, okay. We'll come back and we'll try these next week. Um, and then we'll try to go for both the ed good ending here, or the the cutting ties, and then the embracing the Tuyo ending. And then, yeah, just I didn't realize that there'd be so many puzzles. Oh, gosh. Okay, okay. We will come back here next week. Tomorrow, we have uh, the ending of Home Sweet Home, and then the regular schedule as it is on, on the schedule. So chat thank you for stopping by i'm sorry we weren't able to finish this but we made an incredible amount of progress and we will finish it we'll finish it next week oh, i'm so excited chat. i really want to go through the rest of the endings <laughs> okay okay we'll call it here though thank you everyone chat thank you thank you i need to go get some food so i will see you all tomorrow kuyasumi everyone kuyasumi There are so many endings, chat. We gotta try them all. We gotta try them all. All right, let me go check real quick and see if I can send you on a raid to one of our boys who may be streaming or a stream is coming up anytime soon. It looks like, ooh, Fleon and Altair I'm gonna go ahead and do a continuation of their visual novel uh, stream. Yeah, so we'll go send you over to their waiting room. They'll be going live in about 30 minutes at 1 p.m. Pacific, 4 p.m. Eastern. So, again, everyone, thank you so much for stopping by. I had a wonderful time with these. <sighs> Can't wait to go see more. <laughs> it was canceled. Oh no, it was postponed. Altair's sick. Ah, okay, okay. 
In that case, thank you for letting me know, chat. We'll go and send you over to a raid into Battle's Week in Review stream, which is scheduled for an hour and a half away at 2 p.m. Pacific, 5 p.m. Eastern. All right. Thank you again, everyone, for all the help. Next week, next week, we're going to get them all. All right. Koyasimi, chat. Koyasimi.